Hey, what's up? Shut up. Whoa! You just got here! Relax! You can't just say that to me. Yeah, no Minecraft today. Layla's not feeling good. Sometimes you just get got. Sometimes it do be how it do be, guys. But that's okay, I got this nasty weirdo game. This game gives me Lisa vibes. You know what I mean? People who know, know. I've been putting off streaming it for a long time. Should be a good time. It's got some uh, really creative combat. Workout theme now. This game, oh, don't worry. This game's got its own OST that's got some pretty good bangers. Don't, don't you worry. There's gonna be some uh, adjacent sounds. Dude, I did a pretty good sound bite of that right there. Hold up, I did that pretty good. <laughs> if I ever recreate it again, I'll actually fuck it up. So that was a one-off. Damn. Penis music only. Guys, get over it. <laughs> you fucking nasty bastards, get over it. Penis music bit is over. It's been two streams. It's time to move on. That bit stinks like death because it's rotten. It's rotten. It's, un it's unusable. It's all messed up. All right. Oh yeah, there should there should be a there should be a fun one. There should be a fun one today. I'm uh, I'm excited. He says that every day. It's never fun. That not wrong. You just you just don't know what fun is. You just don't know. Clearly, that's why I'm here. Whoa. Whoa. Today, it's actually gonna be fun. Guys, this is a fun game. All right? We're playing like a lovely roguelike. We're playing a lovely roguelike. Like, it's gonna be a good time. We've got this lovely cast of characters. There's, there's fish in it that cry at you, and then you have to kill them. But then they turn out to be bad, I'm pretty sure, so it's okay. The fish only seem bad. Like, it seems bad to kill them until they until they show that they're really not cool. I, guys, the fish started it. This game for me is like Isaac. I can always find a way to rig everything in my favor. I haven't played a lot of this game because I, I played a bit and then I was like, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna stream it because I don't want to spoil any more for me. I want to do it on stream. So uh, I haven't gotten too deep into the combat, but it is very unique. So I got some cool ideas. It should be a good time. But yeah, we should, uh, have a mighty fine, a mighty fun stream. And then after that, tomorrow, maybe I stream again. Maybe I don't. Okay. Guys, honestly, I'm just like kind of trying to aim my day off for when Like a Dragon comes out, the new one. So I can just play that all day and not be on stream. You know what I mean? Sometimes a game comes out where you're just like, that's my, that's my game for the day. So, uh, I'm, uh. Teeing up my time on that. Teeing it up. Trying to tee up a day off to land right on that game. 
Guys, Tekken 8 coming out too. Will this be the the will this be the fighting game I play for more than an hour? Probably not. But it looks fun. Will this be the fighting game I actually play online? No. No, Tekken is too hard for you. Nah, dude. I really like the style of Tekken. I'm not big into, like, 2D playing fighting games, all right? I, some of you people grew up on Budokai 3, and that's fine. That's cool. Some of us grew up on Tenkaichi, and we like our 3D plane. All right? We like to rotate around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Being good at Tekken is so difficult. Chat, you guys need to step back for a second and remember that if everyone's bad, then it's okay. <laughs> that's what... That's what rankings are for. So all the good people get put in their little corner while everyone that sucks at the game slaps each other around. <laughs> if, if, if it's hard for everyone, then that's fine. You know? You know what I mean, man? Guys, it's fine to be just okay at fighting games. Dude, it's like being just okay at League. You know, once... Not that I've played it, all right? I'm saying this as an outsider looking in at people that are just okay at League. Once you get past being just okay and you enter, like... The place where people expect you to be good, all of a sudden everything fucking sucks and it seems like you want to die. It seems like the only option at that point is to die. So like, I, I don't know. I'm quite happy being painfully average at most multiplayer games because then I'm not fighting anyone that's trying too hard. You know, I love being in the bracket for competitive games where everyone's just kind of like, eh, if I lose, it's cool. You know, that's great for me. I don't remember the last time I played a, like, competitive, like, combat of any kind game. First person or, like, fighting game. Like, properly online with randos, though. It might have been For Honor, but that was a different time for me. I was a different person back then. Uh, no, I didn't play competitive Overwatch. Actually, wait, no, I did play some competitive Overwatch 2. Only a little, though. Uh, and that was with, like, friends. I wouldn't have done that with a team I didn't know. That was only with, like, full groups of friends. For honor, though. You could play Tekken with Sam. He's probably gonna play it. I want to try it. Like, honestly. Like, I'm not big into Street Fighter style. Like, 2D playing fighting games. I kind of want to try Tekken. I think I might try it. Plus, honestly... The combat looks really silly compared to most other fighting games. It seems a lot more like fluid. It's more like more like spacing and stuff in it. It looks like fun. But yeah, I was uh I was a lawbringer main for Anna back before they fucking like tried to improve them. I was a classic lawbringer main, and you know what that meant? Light attack, shove, light attack, shove, light attack, shove, light, light attack, uh, shove, grab face, throw off clip. I win. I win. And then the other person would uh, alt F4. <laughs> I win. <laughs> I win, you lose. Uninstall game. Yeah. It was that or I played, uh, I think I played, um, whatever the name of that class, uh, was that, uh, had, like, the spear, the bleed spear. Nabushi? I did them too. That was also fun. Because you just bleed people and then you just kind of step back and watch them squirm for a little bit as they try to stop you from uh, running away. Oh, man. I hope they make another For Honor. Dude, honestly, you want to know the fastest way you get me in another fighting game? Make another For Honor. That's, that's, my, that's my zone. 
All right, you make another Ferrano, you'll reawaken the darkness within me. But Ubisoft uh, wouldn't dare. <laughs> they, they wouldn't. They 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 wouldn't dare. I don't. I don't think they'll ever do that. Damn. They literally announced a new For Honor cartridge today. See, that's the thing is that like, For Honor is like impossible to, like the only people really playing For Honor anymore, at least from how I'm looking at it, maybe I'm wildly mistaken, are people that have been playing it for the last fucking five years straight. There's no like, no one's casually getting into For Honor anymore. The people that are there are there. Feels like the game needs a sequel in order to encourage a new audience to play it because no one's gonna pick up an old fucking like six-year-old game anymore and get into it it doesn't really happen nowadays you kind of need to make a sequel so i hope one day they'll do that because it's not about like for honor is still good it's still for honor it's like fun but like no new people are gonna come in and like when you're playing like a competitive kind of like fighting game like that it's nice to have people that are like at your skill level because I would definitely be too, too rusty to want to play uh, to want to play against some of those psychos. To be fair, the same thing happened with Monster Hunter World. Yeah, but Ubisoft doesn't have the pull Capcom does to just fit, be like, do you guys remember our game? You should all go play it again. And then everyone does. Dude, Ubisoft doesn't know how to do something like that. They don't, they don't have that kind of pull. Yeah, it's too bad. It's too bad. Maybe someday. Maybe someday. I just want a new Rainbow Six Vegas. You're not gonna get one, man. You're not gonna get one. You're not gonna get one. You mean Siege? You mean a new character in Siege? I mean, you gotta give Ubisoft some credit on one thing. When they make a games as a service, they fucking froth at the mouth to support that thing for another million years. They really don't drop the ball. A lot of other devs, they drop the ball after a while. Ubisoft, they never let it go. Unless it's the crew. At which point, they let it go. The what? Yeah, exactly. No one likes cars. Dude, honestly, you want to know how you get me back into playing another racing game? Burnout, motherfucker. Stop with this bullshit. I don't give a shit about Forza. No matter how many horizons you put upon my freaking like screen. Okay, the only thing that's going to get me back is burnout. All right, Burnout Paradise, Im amazing game. Probably the best racing game I've ever played in my life. All right. Now make another one, now. Now make another, nah, Twisted Metal. Don't act like you played the one on PS3. <laughs> Don't act like you cared. Don't act like you fucking cared. I like Twisted Metal, but don't act like you care. Do you know what they need to make a new one of? Crash Team Racing. A real one. I know they made a remake. Make a new one. New real one. Give me a new real one. Come on now. Come on now. Come on now. Good luck with that, my guy. It's gonna happen. <laughs> we need Oblivion Remastered. I guess we should be, look guys, the best thing that happens now with Bethesda is that they just keep making new games because at least that's better than them going back to Skyrim forever. So frankly, I would prefer they don't also go back to Oblivion instead after and just focus on making new things. Please God, please fucking God. You're, 
they're the most like stagnant piece of shit freaking developing team I've ever seen. It, like Starfield meant nothing to anyone, and they really <laughs> they need they need to just focus on making new things and like buckling down, dude. All right, I don't want to see any more fucking remasters or remakes of anything they've ever worked on in their entire fucking catalog. Just like make games, okay? Starfield won a Steam Award, Tomato. I know, but that don't mean nothing at all. Because Red Dead Redemption 2 won most supported game on the Steam Awards this year, despite the fact it hasn't had a real update since 2021. <laughs> <laughs> despite the fact that since 2021, Red Dead Redemption 2 has not received an update on its platform, but who cares? It's equivalent to the Juan Spice Award. Yeah. 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 I know this game clicks, but yeah, basically. Basically. Yeah, I don't think, I, dude, it's like, here's the thing. Starfield doesn't have any art, like, look, say what you want about Bethesda games. Both Fallout and Elder Scrolls have very, like, iconic styles that have survived many decades each. And it's appealing. It makes those games appealing in and of itself. Starfield doesn't even have that. <laughs> so like, I don't know. I look at Starfield and I'm like, what in this is gonna make me wanna play this over like just Fallout 4 with like a boatload of mods? What could possibly pull me in on that? I think the setting that I care the least about in like RPGs is space. The only game that's ever made me care about sci-fi space setting in an RPG was Mass Effect. And it's because Mass Effect fucking pulled a lot better shit everywhere else to make it worth me caring about it. You know? Mass Effect had a lot of other shit going on in it than just like a setting. Outer Wilds is better. Outer Wilds is not an RPG. not Prey 2016. I didn't beat Prey 2016 because I lost interest in it because it's a sci-fi RPG. I just fall off that shit really easily, guys. I never beat it. I've tried a million times. Like, I get, like, halfway through Prey and then I drop off. And I know it's a good game, but, like, I just drop off interest. I can't, man. I can't. I know it's a good game. I'm never gonna tell anyone it isn't, but I can't. I can't. Do you, do you do the same for Bioshock? Bioshock is not sci-fi in the way that I'm describing, which is like space-faring sci-fi. Bioshock is totally different. So therefore, no. Yeah, no. Bioshock's fine. I actually, like, one of my favorite designs in games for, like, if you're gonna do sci-fi is, like, alternate reality, like, old-school sci-fi, like, like Fallout, like Bioshock, where, like, you're not a hundred million years in the future. You're like 50 years ago, but technology developed differently. I think that's one of the most interesting ways to do sci-fi. Like those kind of like, you know, more like punk style approaches. It comes off because usually when they do that, when a game does that for its like tech and for its world building, it comes with a lot of more, a lot more interesting plot points and a lot more interesting reasons to explain how these advances came to be. Instead of it just being like super sci-fi and it's like, the reason this all exists is because it's been 500 years, guys. Everyone stop asking questions. Fuck. It's like, instead it's like, no, there's a specific reason these things exist. And that's way more interesting to me.
Like, I think, like, Mass Effect kind of had that problem, but then they were like, it's all, it's all the Mass Effect drives. That's why everything's cool. And we have the future now is because of this one thing. It's like, okay, now that's cool. I, I can, like, I can kind of get it, but it's still the hardest setting for me to get into. I love how Disco just says, yeah, we have spatial anomalies. We really don't care. Oh, I love how Disco just drops in, like, insane sci-fi and, like, supernatural shit into its game and then tries to explain it and then is just like, you know what, never mind, you you can try to get it if you want, fuck you. Hope you rolled Encyclopedia. It's very well done. It doesn't put it center stage, but if you take the right things, you can find out a lot of crazy shit about the world. Half Light wants me to yell. Yeah. 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 Damn, I want to play through that game again. Fuck. Fuck, man. Don't worry, Tomato will be a Warhammer guy in like three years. I, I can assure you with absolute fucking bulletproof certainty that is never happening. <laughs> Dude, I can't. I can't. Like, I can't. Warhammer is exhausting. Like, the, it's exhausting. It, I've never read any source material that has exhausted me as much as fucking like trying to get into any part of Warhammer. It, it's like the fucking writers at no point like stepped back and were like, should any part of this be like <laughs> accessible to anyone other than us? And then they did another line of crack. <laughs> no, of course not, dude. Fuck. And then they just kept writing. What would you say is worse, Warhammer or SCP? Those aren't the same at all, dude. Those are so, those are so unsimilar that there's no way I can even engage with comparing those two things. SCP is a freaking open source, like community driven and written like, like big pile of individual files. SCP is the Dark Souls of Warhammer. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Guys, they included a ha huh while they were typing that. I think that was a joke. <laughs> like none of you, I, I guess I should have included the ha. Huh. That was a joke. No, he meant it. Uh? Uh? He always reads things wrong. I will never apologize either for misreading anything. You mistyped it by not typing it in a way I could read properly. Fuck you. All right? You mistyped it. You could have just said, you could have just said you'd never apologize. I will never apologize. Ever. Read this bonus ball. Frick. Bonus ball. Goddamn every time. Goddamn. Did we discover if we need to ban Frick yet? Brent. I have an announcement. Frick is in the clear. Okay, cool. Guys, good news. Frick is safe. We do not need to kill off Frick. The real culprit of any demonetization is in fact me cursing like a sailor at the beginning of every VOD.
What about if we say fuck in all caps? If this VOD gets if this VOD gets demonetized because of Katie, that's coming out of your fucking paycheck. All right, I will say that right now. If that if it loops back around to this specific spot, it's coming out of your fucking actual paycheck. Real. Say JK right now. Anyways, guys. Let's stay focused on the task at hand, okay? <laughs> Anyways, I have nothing else to say. So let's stay focused on the task at hand. What was the task at hand? Stalling? Nah, dude, I could get in game right now. Guys, I could get in game right now. I will upload two versions of this VOD, one without intro and one with intro. We will see which one gets fricked. Huh. That would do it. God dang. Are we really gonna find out that my intro is a poison? Dude, that's rough. If true, that's rough. That's bad. I mean, it would make sense. But then again, this game is fucked. Uh, so, I mean, it's probably, it probably in and of itself for themes alone is probably not going to be too great on YouTube. We'll have to see. Oh yeah, no, this ain't gonna make it. Yeah, this one's probably not gonna make it, guys. <laughs> this one... No, I'm going to be honest about some things here. Yeah, this one's probably not going to make it too far. That Lisa the painful ass humor. Yeah, it's basically got the same writing style. We kept fear and you tell me Funger got monetized. Ain't no way. What? I mean, we did edit out the schlongs. And by we, I mean Brett. We did get... We did get rid of all the schlongs in that VOD. Yeah, that would probably help. The royal we, yes. Schlong... Yeah, the entire- guys, the scene of me punching someone's dick off with my bare hands remains monetized but censored. And isn't that just- isn't that just beautiful? Isn't that just beautiful? Brings a tear to my eye. Brings a tear to my damn eye. Excited to announce any VOD that's too spicy on YouTube will now be on Pornhub. Whoa. 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 Whoa, whoa. Honestly, I have no idea what the uh, ad revenue rate is on that side, but uh, who knows? Maybe it's great. Maybe it's great out there. I get enough fucked up DMs as it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jesse Cox tried to do a series on Pornhub. It didn't work out very well. Shocking. 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 Baffling even. I'm shocked. His name is perfectly thematic for Pornhub. And that's what I thought. 
My god, it, it should have been perfect. Damn. If you can't make it out of there, how the hell am I? Damn. All right, chat, I'm gonna go bathroom and then I think we might get in game. We might get in game today. I'll be, I'll be right back. I will be. He's already bored? I don't know, fucking come up with a topic for me to discuss if you want me to not go straight into the game when I get back. All right, you have like 30 seconds. Time's up. Time's up. Riot Games could be something. I don't care about Riot Games. Or they lay people off. Tragic as it's always tragic. 500 people. But yet, the industry remains exactly the same. With no union or overhead to protect any developers. And thus... Things remain as they've always been. What's your take on the recent controversy? I apologize for nothing yet everything depending on who's asking. How many more times do we have to go through this? All right, and anything that you say, anything you pull out of this that you take as a clip, I'll tell you right now is taken out of context. All right. AI. I create polls to figure out how to respond to controversy. Yeah. Yeah. Is everyone getting fired? Every guys, everyone is getting fired. But not me, right? Depends on if this VOD gets monetized. Depends on if the VOD is monetized. Everyone loses. <laughs> Everyone loses. Tomato, are streamers ever gonna unionize? <laughs> yeah, right! Dude, people tried for one day to have no one stream on Twitch to like make a fucking statement about some shit and literally no one did it. All right. That, yeah, right. Dude, this job is literally built off of taking advantage of other people not streaming so you can benefit from the vacuum they've left to pull their audience for yourself. Do you think for a fucking second anyone is going to unionize? Dude, this is like the most cutthroat industry on the fucking internet. What are you, crazy? Unfortunately, that's not possible. I can still dream of the 18-story content house. That's why Tomato's my good friend until he gets some 3,000 viewers and the friendship is over. None of it matters once you've lost your clout, guys. Once your clout is gone, it's over. Once it's gone, it's all over. But yeah. Luckily, 
Nothing horrible has happened to the extent where a union has needed to- Actually, no, that's fucking completely not true. But either way, we're never- Actually, constant horrible things- Wait, what am I fucking saying? Constantly, this industry has been fucked left, right, and centered by everyone. It's fucking horrific out here. It is- it is nasty. But it's never gonna change, and we're never gonna make a union about it. Because that would involve, a, a, like, people actively stepping away from working for a day. And in an industry where you're actively encouraged to work every single day until you die. Uh, unfortunately, that's not possible. So... Uh, the union, a union as streamers would exist for about five people, and of those five, three of them would get sick of trying to follow any of the union guidelines within about a week. And, uh, everyone else would be just kind of doing what they always do. Yeah, it's the, it's the unfortunate reality of working in an industry that encourages taking opportunities as they arise and maximizing the amount of gain you have from those opportunities. Not a single person is going to be like, yeah, my union says I'm not supposed to stream this week because we're going on strike. And then like what's going to happen is a fucking like a big publisher is going to be like, you want early access to our game? There's an embargo. You have to play it by tomorrow or the access to the game gets removed. And all of a sudden, the, all of a sudden that whole, uh, that whole thing doesn't really, you know, you, you end up streaming. <laughs> Scab streamers. Yeah, I mean, Chet, that's, you have to remember all streamers are working for themselves. No streamer is working for you as another streamer. You're working for yourself first and foremost. There's not exactly, it's not like a union for another like company where like you are all collectively working together on the same end goal. You're all working for yourselves. So ain't none of it matters, unfortunately. My personal friend, Tomato. Smile. Is that a parasocial chat member in there? Chat, what if... What if all unionize against Tomato? My favorite hate stream. Tomato. Smile. He's speaking directly to me. Wow. Wow. We are unionized. We get the day off when Tomato doesn't stream. Exactly! You guys get a lovely day off whenever I don't stream. Think about that. Isn't that nice? Wait, this is a paid gig? Except for you. You, uh, you aren't getting any money, man. You specifically aren't getting any. Sorry, man. Wait, where's my pay? You two are also not getting it. Sorry, man. You guys want to play Brutal Orchestra? Does everyone have their fun instrument that they're going to play during the orchestra? Recital today? Check this out, I got mine right here. Yeah. All right, guys. Brutal orchestra. Let's 
time. Bro, he isn't listening. What? Tomato, sir, please, I have an important question to ask you. All right, from now on, I, I would appreciate if you always refer to me as sir, if that's the way we're going to be. Like, if that's the energy here, then that's fine by me. I expect that from now on. Now, what's the question? Who is your favorite Muppet? Gonzo. All right, now that we got there, start game. Ow. What the? What the hell? Oh god, they're talking in fucking simlish, dude. Okay. Okay. All right. Vengeance. I love vengeance. Oh, he's all meaty, dude. Look at all that meat. Nothing? He gets nothing out of this. Okay. Oh, he's got that meaty hand, too, man. He gets content. This dude's a fucking streamer. He's getting content out of this, guys. Okay. Before we proceed, this will all be simpler if I knew your name. If you ever even had one. My name? Noak. The demon recoils as if pained. Noak. Really? Yeah. Well, no, Ak. My name is Bosch. Bosch? Okay. Purgatory's landscape is deeply incoherent. You can't navigate it without me. I'll present you with points of interest that converge to our ultimate goal. Follow these shortcuts and you'll never find yourself trapped in the nonsensical geometry of this world. Simply let me know where you'd like to go and I'll light the way. Fate will do the rest. There's only one path ahead of me, chat, and it's a simple one. To that singular fish. To, there's one fish in front of me. That is the only option forward, is to fight through them. One fish must die. Now, hang on a second. Party. Our party consists of one guy. Noak. Who's got some basic moves. We don't have any items. I do not have the money to rank up my character. My only option is to go towards fish. Oh my god. They're just... Not moving. They're just sitting there. Oh. Bosh? Why are these fish trying to fight me? I didn't do anything to them. What? Why would I know that? Listen, just kill them quickly so we can get moving. How? I don't know, stop them or something. Muscle memory. What? Okay, click on yourself and select an ability. Click, what, what are you talking about? Just hit the perform ability and then end your turn. What? Okay. So this is Among? Among! Sus! It's a fish. It has two moves. Nipple, which deals almost no damage to the opposing party member and tickles a little. And sob. This enemy cries and produces one blue pigment, which the game will explain soon. I'm gonna use my only move, Rough Takedown. 
which uses two yellow spheres. Get the fuck out of here. Wow. You got some pent up anger, don't you? Don't look now, but there's more than just blood on your hands. See those red orbs down below? That's pigment. Everything in purgatory bleeds their stuff. In fact, you had to use some yellow pigment to even perform that ability. Don't worry about pigment too much for now, but try not to let it overflow. What happens if it overflows? You instantly die. Oh. I'm just kidding. You die slowly. Okay. Well, I got th I got three more shit in here. I'm gonna end my turn. He tried nibbling in front of him and nothing happened because there was no one there. Move. I know, I know. Just use your mouse and drag yourself to where you need to be. Okay. There's five positions. There's a subtle grunt on the ground. Okay. Keep in mind that where your ability is hit is based on your position. You can move and also perform one ability per turn. You don't have to do both. Okay. I slide in front of the other fish and I kill them. Die for We won, chat. We defeated the fish. And I made three dollars. Wow, you're a natural. Those defenseless fish didn't stand a chance. You know, all the best serial killers start out killing small animals as well. You have potential. Uh, thanks. All right. Give my head a tap. When you want to get moving again, I'll let you know where we can head to. Do I have to tap your head? Can't I just tell you I'm ready to go? No. And make sure you don't have any unfinished business. Once we leave, we'll never return. There's only one way forward, and it's to this strange man. All right, go make some allies. We'll need all the help we can get. What? Why can't you do it? Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention that part. No one can really see me but you. Now, I know what you're thinking. This guy isn't actually a cool oil demon. He's just some psycho manifestation of my deep unresolved traumas. What? No, I... It's okay. It's logical to think that. In fact, I'm pretty sure you're a manifestation of my deep unresolved traumas. Anyway, we're both well-adjusted normal adults that can carry a conversation. Go make friends! Okay, man. Oh, uh, hey! Oh, this one looks like he has some fight left in him. And the kind of self-loathing we can work with. Go talk to him, find out what we're dealing with. Hello. We're looking for a traveling companion. Would you be interested in traveling with us? To try and find some place better than this? Well, Oh, uh... You look a wee bit too lonely to be a wee. Hit your head a touch too hard on the way down here? Seeing people that don't exist? God, this guy's a dick. Okay, gee, I got, I got the message. Have fun rotting here, I guess. Nah, come back. So, what is this plan of yours? We go parade ourselves into oblivion looking for heaven or something? No, it's more like... I'm in. As long as you promise it'll be more exciting than rotting here, I'm in. Do I look like I have something better to do? Boyle has become an ally. That was really easy. I hope that continues to be really easy to get allies. Who's this guy? Who's this fucking weirdo? Hello. You are forming a colony? Uh, is this thing even human? It looks too polypy for my taste. I wish to integrate into this pre-colonial mass. No, no, we're just a traveling party, not a mess. I am being rejected. Bro. <laughs> Bro. Hey. No, you can come with us if you like. Are you, are you able to fight? I lack the anatomical elements to inflict harm effectively. However, my being is antiseptic in nature. Perhaps my value could be derived from mitigating incoming harm. Yeah, we, we could use a medic. Tag along. I will accompany your traveling party until I succumb to asphyxiation. Great, we're barely into this journey and you've made friends with a talking hemorrhoid. 
Hans has become an ally. Guys, we have a friend. His name is Hans. Welcome to the team. At least we have one character with a big smile on their face. All right, time to kill more little fish. What's up with that one? Wait, what? Hold up. Oh! Why do the fish have bodies now? Oh, this one I actually know. They want revenge for you killing their friends earlier. And they couldn't kick your ass without feet, so they found some. Are you serious? Yeah, sure. Before you go getting beaten to death here, if you ever don't have the right pigment to get the job done, you can always drag in the wrong one. Doing this will hurt you a bit, but hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. They've, um, it looks like they've climbed inside a rotting corpse and are currently steering it with their, uh, fish body. Just horrible. Just horrible. Okay, well, um... Fortunately, Noak is the only one that gets a free starting move because we always start with three yellow. So I'm gonna move over to this baby and I'm gonna fucking kill him. Die, freak. And I got focus. Whenever my character kills an enemy, they get focused, which boosts their damage by two additional points or deal 50% more damage against enemies with higher health. That's a really good buff. That's actually an insane buff. Wait, 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 wait. Focus is lost upon receiving any damage. Okay, copy that. So what's this guy do? Deal five damage to the left and right enemies. Okay, he has a cleave attack and he can deal eight damage to an opposing enemy if I have three red. I do not. He also has a slap, which just uses one of my free yellows. And what does Hans do? Attempted mend, I can heal Hans and the left ally for four health if I have three blues. I can also, with two blues and a red, put frail on an enemy. I don't know what that does. Or I can slap. Okay, so I'm gonna move Hans out of the way. Uh, once I've confirmed, one of, this guy's attacking with a chomp forward. This one is gonna eat one of my pigments and then move left or right and apply shield. Okay. I'm gonna move, actually I don't need to move this guy to do this attack. So we're gonna attack with this cleave for five damage on the mud lug. And I'm gonna have everyone stay exactly where they are. Uh, I have no attack I can do without burning an extra pigment on Hans. So I'm just gonna hang out. Piece of cake. They ate one of my reds. My red! You might have figured this out already, but you can even swap positions that are occupied. If you do that, both you, both of you will just switch places. Okay, I got it. Uh, I'm gonna move. I'm actually going to do it like this. I'm gonna move Noak here. I'm gonna have him attack because he's gonna do double damage because this guy has... Oh wait, no. He... Fuck! I fucked it! He doesn't have more health than me. Oh well, we're still gonna get him. Uh, I'm gonna do the cleave. Look, I'm getting- I gotta get used to the combat still. We're gonna do the- What the fuck? Okay, a, a normal Mung came out. Uh, I'm gonna do, uh... This guy's gonna do a forward attack on Hans. I'm gonna have Hans move out of the way. And that's gonna be his move. He's gonna run. Scamper run out of there, little guy. And now this guy- I should have mentioned this earlier, but I actually know exactly what the enemy is going to do. At the top of the screen, there's a timeline which contains all the information about what the enemies are going to do in what, in what order. Why can't you just give normal advice? Okay. Uh, all right, I'm gonna do smack. Get rid of him. Kill that freak. Move Boyle here. And he's gonna do the cleave and we win. He's a cake. As simple as that. <sighs> one more round and then it's over. That guy's dead in one more move, guys. One more move and this Mung is dead. He doesn't even have any way to attack back right now. Just kill him. Eight damage, he's dead. We move on. All right. 
Another three dollars. All right, time to do this for real. I've been spoon feeding you baby steps so far. Now it's time for you to make some decisions. Choose a path ahead, lead the way. Wow, I can go anywhere? Yeah. Well, anywhere I think is worth visiting. That doesn't sound like me making decisions. Um, I guess it really isn't. Tragic. Okay, well, my options are what looks to be a chest, a worm, or the nastiest fuck I've ever seen in my entire life. I'm gonna take the loot. We're going for the chest, guys. I'm not going near that thing. Whatever that thing was, I ain't going near it. Hang on, I'm open. Ten dollars! Ten coins from hell. Money! Money? Oh, yeah, you can buy stuff with that. You can even buy people. Isn't that essentially slavery? Don't think too hard about it. You can also use money to make yourself or other party members stronger in the rank cut menu at the bottom of the screen. Really? Wow. Where does the money go when I spend it on ranking up? Oh. I don't want to talk about it. Okay, well, I'm going to rank up my main character, which boosts my... It looks like just my damage. Okay. Oh! Well, I mean, I, I already fought a fish. I guess I'll fight the weirdo. How bad can it be? Oh, it's bad. Oh! What the fuck is that? Oh! That's it. I'm gonna have to kill him. What do they do? Deals agonizing amount of damage to the opposing party member and then heart. The heartbreaker. Okay, well, I'm gonna kill him. I think is what's gonna happen. Which one's attacking? The one in front is attacking, so we're gonna do the cleave on them. So I'm gonna attack this guy to build red. Because when we attack something, we get red pigment from their health bar. So that gets me enough to do the cleave on this one. Boom. Perfect. Now you! Do nothing. Stay exactly where you are. Next turn. Oh, oh! Ah, hell. They're shielding themselves. Shields will block your damage. And unfortunate, fortunately, their shield doesn't move with them, so you can push them out of it. You can also just wait for it to crumble on its own. I don't care. We'll kill them anyways. My attack does eight damage, so this guy's dead. Boom. And when we get hit, we make purple meter. Okay, it's coming together. It's coming together. When we get hit, we make purple, uh pigment which is used for like my guys like special move wow look at you looks like you have become focused i already know what this does quiet i already know it uh boil and have him move to here to do his cleave oh i have an eight damage attack i wouldn't have had the pigment for it anyways um you move forward and then just kind of hang out actually we're gonna be fine we got this on the next turn we win next turn. Next turn, this freak dies. They moved out of the way of their own shield. They literally don't know what they're doing. Kill them! Put them down! 10 damage. Piece of cake. Put them down! Put them down! Kill them! And another six dollars. All right, I'm ready to go. More chests, more loot. You have obtained the Crooked Die. Adds unstable to this party member as a passive. Decreases incoming damage by one to six. Oh, nice, you got an item. Is that good? Yeah. yeah. Well, usually it depends. From the items menu, you can drag the item onto a party member to activate its effects. You can get some really crazy effects going. Experiment. Okay, uh, I don't know what unstable means, but I'm gonna put it on our healer so he doesn't blow up. For now. That makes sense. Who the hell's this idiot? I'm going to him. Hang on, I'm also gonna rank up, uh, Boyle. Hey. Whoa. What is this thing? Uh. Oh, I'd make friends with the freak. Hello? Hello. Goodbye. What? I will skin you alive. Are you looking for allies? Are you threatening me? No, but I think my other half is. Of course I am, you babbling fool. 
I, I don't understand. Go away before I fracture the rest of your skull. I'd be happy to accompany you if you'd like. Uh, now look at me. I don't understand this any better than you do. You can come with us? Great, let's go. I demand blood. You demand blood? Oh, I'm demanding blood again. Blood, blood, blood. What the hell? Just come back to me after you've already gotten someone killed. It doesn't matter who. Blood! Experience a loss worthy of our presence. I want to come with you, but I don't have the final say in this matter. Come back later. Okay. Well, bye. <laughs> See ya, man. I guess I'll go kill this worm. Worms. Oh! Okay, well, they can't move. It looks like they're anchored to the spot. Uh, I'm gonna kill this fish first of all, because... Wait, 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 wait. Okay, they're... this one's attacking with a right and left attack. So I'm gonna move Noak out of the way. And I'm gonna kill this fish. And I'm gonna swap Boil here with Hans. And have Boil do a cleave attack on these idiots. Killing that one instantly. This guy's fucked on his next turn. No problem. We got him. We got him. This guy's done so. Die, freak. This game's too easy. Guys. Game's too easy. Two dollars. Next, another treasure chest. Five dollars. That gives me the chance to upgrade Hans to the maximum possible rank in this area. Very good. I don't have any money for a uh, shop anymore, so we're gonna go fight this fish. These two idiots are fucked. That one's attack. Which one's attacking forward? That one? Uh, I think I'll have enough to kill this guy if I just do this. I can hit him with that one and then he can hit with the cleave. Yeah. Problem solved. This guy's dead on his next turn. He's gonna move forward and shield. But Hans sucks? No, guys, we're not gonna kill Hans. Guys, we're keeping... Wait a minute. Upon taking damage, this party member will randomize all stored pigment. That sounds bad for me. That sounds, um, like maybe the worst thing that could happen to me. Hang on. I'm gonna put frail on this guy. <sighs> that enemy is frail. That means next time you strike them, they will receive double damage. Okay. I'm gonna move Noak into the position and smack him. And instantly kill them. All right. I am in complete control. One dollar. Who's this guy? How do you think the fish figured out how to do that? Do what? Pilot human corpses around like some kind of horrifying meat puppet. What else do you think I meant? Do you think that one fish figured it out and the rest copied them, or they just kind of knew? Oh, that conversation seemed like a waste of time. I'm not sure what you expected talking to random strangers. Well, I thought they would help us or something. Like a quest or... Uh, no, most people down here are just weirdos waiting to waste away. Not everyone is useful. Yeah, lots of them don't even want to be useful. Best not to dwell too hard on it. Gotta keep an eye out for those few that are worth something, though. Maybe it was like how we started drinking milk. Some pervert diddled a cow and then reluctantly shared his findings with the world. And now we all drink milk. At all times, maybe we're just one pervert away from greatness. Maybe the world just needs the right pervert in the right place. And oh boy, am I in the right place. What? What in the hell are you talking about? Listen, I don't expect a simpleton like you to understand, but I'm gonna need you to leave. I'm about to change the world. I'm like a horny Jesus. What the fu- I gotta get the hell out of here. Nothing will ever be the same. I gotta get the hell out of here. Who's this guy? Get me out of here. Hey. <sighs> what a mess. 
Hey. Hey. The man turns from observing the impaled corpses. Hmm? Oh, hi. He turns back to the corpses. Noak, what are you doing? I I'm asking this guy to join us. Uh, this guy obviously killed these men. He must have some sort of spike powers. I don't trust anything about this. Spike powers? That could be a thing. I've seen weirder. Spike powers sounds helpful. I think we should ask him to join us. No, not this one. I'm putting my foot down. You don't have feet. I'll put you down if you keep giving me attitude like that. I think Spike, I, 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 this is the last one, I promise. Come on, this is the last one. I'll stop collecting freaks after this. You're absolutely awful at lying. Let's go, there are lots of other freaks for you to meet. This one just isn't coming with us. I, I'm gonna go talk to him anyways. I, what, 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 uh, fucking, what do you want from me? You start walking over to talk to him. What do you think you're doing? Making allies. Nope. A searing pain suddenly grips your chest. Take one more step and I'll kill us both and start all this over. Seriously? Seriously. Let's go. There's lots of other freaks for you to meet. <sighs> Just next time, dude. Alright, I'm gonna open up this box. What the fuck is that? Lil Homunculus? Prevent any negative effects from being applied to this party member. Upon preventing one of these status effects, decrease this party member's maximum health by one. If this party member's maximum health cannot be decreased further, die. Well, put that on my guy for now. I'm really, I, this guy looks freaky. I'm gonna fight him. Flarb. Whoa, that thing is huge. Some of these creatures are way bigger than I expected. Keep an eye out for monsters that take up two or even more spaces. Maybe if you line it up right, you could hit them with more. You could hit them more than once. A flarb. He's gonna be attacking in front of him in a second, and these two are just attempts to summon a flarb. Okay, these guys. These guys are trying to summon ads. I don't think I want to fight a second flarb. So uh, I'm gonna fucking have to kill him. Problem is, I don't get any red pigment unless I attack the big guy. Which is bad. I'm not really sure how to solve that other than to take a hit, because I kind of need red pigment to kill. Actually, I do eight damage with this. Let's get rid of the one that's attempting to summon. Ain't gonna be summon- Careful! That enemy's health isn't red, so you're gonna be getting different colors of pigment from them. Make sure you're leaving yourself with the kinds of pigment you need. Okay. Well, I got rid of that one. Uh, pukes and produces one purple pigment, a delicacy among perverts near and far. God damn, that fucking weirdo is still out there, isn't he? The weirdo from before. Hang on. I'm gonna build a uh, bit of red here with a slap. Which moves that guy one over, which is fine. I'm gonna move out of the way now. And uh, we're gonna build another little bit of yellow with this extra slap. Boom! So this guy's attacking two more times now because he saw his child getting attacked. Okay. Scary. But we're fine. Oh, he moved! Oh, I forgot. I didn't realize he moves. It's fine. Three damage ain't bad. We can heal that. We're fine. Uh, I'm gonna... Yeah, I'm gonna hit the flarb now, I think. I think I'm gonna beat the crap out of this flarb. Yeah, I think I think it's time to unleash great vengeance upon them. Boom. 12 damage. And that's gonna push him out of the way. How much does Boyle do with his main attack? I can kill this guy right now. Perfect. Bam! And now we just need Hans to move in and complete the battle with a firm but confident slap. Boom. We are dealing with a lot of pigment though. Do I have to kill you still or are we done here? I have to, guys, I gotta kill, I gotta put this freaking flarblet down, guys. Does anyone have any last words they wanna say to this poor bastard before I kill him? Sorry, flarblet, you gotta die. 
Careful, you're overflowing. You can only hold so much pigment, any more than 10. And you can normally hold, an overflow will begin. Try attacking nothing, just a burn through pigment. Try not to make a habit of dealing with overflow. Okay. But it looks like I'm fine. $12. Oh, what the fuck? That's a different icon. I don't want to fuck with that. We're going to keep fighting. We're going to keep killing things for money. No, like try to go to a shop. Uh, that guy's going to do a forward attack. This guy's also going to do a forward attack, but I can kill them if I do all this right now. And I can do it like a fun cleave move. Bada bing. Boom. Simple as that. And it made another one. And that one's gonna make a bunch of yellow pigment for me. Okay. Hans! Hit them with your most powerful move. Which is, never mind. You have nothing you can do. Hans, run over there and hide. Useless fucking character. <laughs> Useless piece of trash. All right, well, I'm gonna kill the uh, Mung with this. Boom. And I'm gonna move. Uh, I'm gonna move Boil into the middle here and have him do another cleave. Yep. Hans. Oh shit! He slid in the way of. Oh boy, Boil's gonna. Hans, move into position and do a. Hang on. Using the wrong pigment prevents this party member from healing themselves. But if I use it, I can still heal Boil. I like to heal them. They're gonna take 20% damage. How much is this gonna actually hurt them though? Two? Two? It's fine, it's fine. I prefer the heal on the character that's gonna like constantly be in front of people. What was that? Gross, you're all coated in oil. When smacked, you'll slide around, but stay away from fire. Seriously, please stay away from fire. Okay. Well, whatever. We got him. This guy's done. Take him down. He's a cake. $18. Is there a shop? Ooh, who's this guy? This guy's more important than a shop. Who is this? Baloo Bibbidi Badius. Vevidor? Oh. What? Vedi Vedi Vasim. Are you speaking English? Sakoko. Medidar Abbargo. Zappy. Okay. Alu Averdis Meso Ablebius. What? Ah. Vagagna. Okay, bye. <laughs> okay, bye bye. Never gonna forget you. I'm gonna go to the store and see if there's anything I can buy from this weirdo. First aid. Heal this party member one health at the end of each turn. That's immediate purchase. Uh. Let's see. Increase this party member's maximum health by five. Apply one to twelve shield to this party member's position at the beginning of each turn. Wait, that's insane, possibly. Take that. Okay, okay, okay. So first aid's gonna go to Hans. I'd like them to always have first aid. And I want our tank guy that needs to be in perfect position in the center all the time to have the extra shield. This random chance thing is gonna go to Nowak because I think the fetus, I think the little homunculus fetus thing is uh, not as good as everything else. So now, uh, I feel like this is a boss, and I'm allowed to keep doing these until I want to fight the boss. So I wouldn't mind going into a- I wouldn't mind having more money. I may be getting another party member before I do that. Why am I still on stay? Oh yeah, because I put the crooked die on. Alright, these guys are both gonna make... Uh... Yellow pigment. I gotta burn. We gotta burn. We gotta get slaps in, guys. We need to burn. I just beat the shit out of him as fast as we can. Slap him, take him down. I mean, that's also gonna make pigment, though, I guess. Uh, I can heal. I'm gonna do that. 
burn some more while healing. I mean, the music, I, dude, I love this fucking music, though. Listen to this shit. Damn. All right, I'm going to kill this one. We are about to overflow. Well, this is bad. We need to burn some. I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna kill this one in one move. It's gonna hurt Boyle a lot, but it'll get the job done. Die, freak! Ah! It was worth it, or I think we all take damage. Who's this guy? This place is miserable. I miss my dog. I'd trade any of you saps for another moment with him. He was such a good boy. You want me to find your dog? What? My dog is still alive and well, and I don't want you laying one doggy diddling finger on him. Whoa, man, what the fuck? He'll arrive once he's finished his long and luxurious life. Okay, jeez. <laughs> arf, arf. <laughs> Bro. Five dollars. Okay, we're running out of options. We can either fight the big guy or fight the big, big guy. I'm gonna fight one more. No, I'm gonna fight the big guy. I think I made a big mistake, guys. Versus, oh, fuck. Mobius? Okay. Okay. All right. Well, um, I'm gonna go ahead and go to the left and try to get. Wait, which one of these guys is gonna attack? This one. I'm gonna kill this one to get red. Kill the ad. Get some red. Nice. And then I can move Boyle here and do a. Hang on. What's this guy's attack? He's gonna do a, a far. Oh boy. I should have checked that. It's fine. I'm gonna move Boyle here so we can do a cleave on these two and kill the other ad for more red. And I'm gonna keep Hans here to heal Nowak once he takes damage in another turn. So I'm gonna have him do a firm but meaningful. No, no, he's actually just gonna hang out. He's actually gonna hang out a turn. I'm gonna have him hang out a turn. He'll be fine. This can't hurt that bad. Oh, the dice worked. We're good, we're good. Is that blood? I didn't know you guys could bleed. Looks like you've been ruptured open. While ruptured, you'll take damage every time you move. Give it a few turns and it should wear off. Looks painful. Wait, guys. Hold up, gamer moment, guys. Because Noak didn't take damage because of the dice, I got to keep my focused buff. Oh my God. Gamer moment. I still have my double damage. As long- and that means every time he hits this guy, he's gonna do double damage once I get him over there. So I have to wait for this debuff to go away. And then I can run over there and fucking kill him. Okay. I'm gonna have Hans move here. No matter what, someone's gonna have to get hit, so it's gonna be him in the shield. I'm gonna have him move over there in a second and get in, like, the extra shield. I'm gonna have him do a heal first to try to heal up boy. Very good. Now I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have Boyle do, uh, the hardened clobber even. Wait, if he moved into the middle, would he get two? Wait, he would get two hits. Fuck it, we'll get extra damage. Bash him with the double. Get a bunch of blue to heal next time. Okay, that's gone. Only five damage ain't bad. It's time. Nine, dude, that sulfur powder thing is insane. That means nine damage is reduced on the next attack. He can stay right where he is. Okay, I want Hans to move in and do a heal. I'm gonna have Noak move in too now and do the big hit. This should do insane damage. 
we got a lot of blue, guys. I'm gonna have to start burning the burn, I think. Uh, we're gonna do, we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna do a huge hit just to burn some blue. He'll give some back, but we'll burn some blue. Six. We got the shield, so we won't die or anything. Oh, what the fuck? Four ruptured stacks. Stay in position. Hans, stay in position, goddammit. Don't heal, Hans. Don't heal him. I got something better for you to do. Make this guy frail. We're ending this now. Ah. Wait, is that the sound they make when they get hit? Pathetic. Ow. You've unlocked the skin skate to now be found in chests. You've also unlocked the can of worms. Okay, we're in a new zone and everything looks bad. Do I get a level up now? Yeah, we can start leveling these guys up again. So now we have clean takedown and seething wrath and swift parry. Okay. Um, none of these guys look good, but we might as well start with the biggest, scariest looking thing to assert dominance. Revola and a music man. And what's music man? What the? Feel? All right, guys. So music man is going to do a thing called feel the rhythm where they become an instrument of the ungod. What the fuck is an ungod? And, uh, looks like, uh. This guy's gonna bellow a forward attack, which is gonna hurt everyone. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna have Nowak do a smack before this guy. God, this guy's got a lot of health, Jesus. I'm gonna have Nowak move here to attack the music man. I guess. And get some red. Then I'm gonna have Boyle move over one. I'd like him to get a heal. Actually, he's he's okay. Uh, fuck. I want red. I need red. I need red early. I'm gonna have Boyle do a slap. I'm gonna have Hans do a slap to build some more red. Move Hans over there. I'm gonna have Boyle do a... Yeah, I'm gonna have... I'm gonna have Boyle do a cleave. Even though he'll take a little bit of damage. Because I'm gonna have Hans heal next turn. What's gonna happen with this thing? Oh! What the fuck? Okay, that guy's gonna do foul fluids to all of our current positions, so someone's gotta just take that hit. I guess it'll be... Boy, oh boy, I don't even know. Uh, I'm gonna have Boyle move into the center here to do a full cleave. It'll be Noek, I think, that takes the hit. Yeah. Yeah, I don't have enough to do a real heal. So I'm gonna have Noak stay in that spot and I'll move. I'll move our boy Hans into the middle. Our, our good lad. And, uh. I don't need more red. Actually, I will need more red. Slap him. Give him a smack. And I've still got a move to do. What happens if I hit him with the parry? They're supposed to, like, move, but since I have nowhere to- Oh, you gotta be kidding me! The worst thing that could happen! Okay, they're all- they're all gonna get hit now, guys. Ow. Ow. My health! Your maximum health has changed. Don't worry about. You know, don't worry. Your maximum will uh, reset at the end of combat. Okay. What the f head in the clouds? You can only push someone so far before they stand up for themselves. Okay, chill. I'm gonna move Noak over to kill the fucking creature here. Oh god, we got self damage happening. It's time to start pumping. All right, time to pump. You need to heal them. Heal them now. 
Pump! Pump! Oh! Oh, what the fuck? Oh, that's bad, guys. I don't know if we want that. I'm gonna try to kill them. They're frail right now while they're up there. Which means it's our time. Is this bad? Oh, my god. Flee! Actually, we're gonna have Boyle stay there because there's 16 shield on it. Boyle will not take any damage from this hit. We're gonna have them maintain their position. Wait, no. Boyle, you flee. Hans is also gonna flee. Nowak is gonna go in on the shield and do an attack. Yeah, they might just kill him. Oh yeah, <laughs> never mind, guys. It's okay. Nowak did 30 fucking damage. The shield is crazy. Well, that was easy. It's all these weirdos now. And whatever that is. A writhing spoggle. <laughs> I feel like that's not a word I should say. Like, that's just like a, that's like not, it's just not good. Like, it's, it's, a, it's a wrong, it's like a power word that I shouldn't be, like, channeling. Okay, no way, get a smack in. That guy's gonna do a cleave move. We do not like that, but it's fine. Boyle's gonna do a cleave as well. And then, uh, Hans here will, um... To, uh, evacuate. I mean, they could technically do a heal on Boyle, but I don't really want Hans to take damage. At all, really. I'm gonna have him bug out. Actually didn't take damage from that cleave. That's crazy. Yeah, the shield, the shield item is insane. Okay. I have no act do a hit. And then the cleave should kill this guy. Does it look like we're gonna have enough to get a confirmed kill, but what we will do is heal these two. Very nice, and end turn. The shield is insane. I can just ignore, like, moving with oil. It's really nice. Holy crap. Finish it. Damn! Man. Piece of cake. We have a lot of money. Uh, let's level up Boil. And then we'll heal Hans. We'll level up Hans last. Is that a shop? Yo! Fucking throw it back, dude! Yeah! Fucking get it! What is this? Uh, blood bottle, start combat with three red pigment. That's actually, that'd actually be kind of cracked on, uh, on our boy. Gain a coin upon performing an ability with this party member, 50% chance to lose a coin on turn end. Okay. I'm not going to spend any money. Who's this guy? Wait, wait, wait. Who's this clown? Hey, uh, are you able to hear me in there? No. Okay, moving on. Yeah. Shut up! Every word you speak is a waste. You seek my cooperation, eh? You seek some semblance of meaning in this uncaring place, eh? You wanna see the gods above and below weep, eh? Holy hell, I love this guy. This is great. Punch meaning. Kill God. Uh, yeah. I, I guess. The music, man. They torment me. Prophets of complacency and noise. Silence, though. Or at least understand the virtue of silence. Then return to me. We have to get this guy on the team. Okay, I just have to kill some music, men. That's easy. There's three right here. There's three of these idiots right here. Oh god, they're all gonna turn into music men right away. Okay. Uh, those two are gonna do their thing. I'm just gonna punch this one, because I think we might be able to confirm a kill on the one right in front of us. With the cleave. 
Maybe. With the level up. Dude, 10 damage on each hit is insane, actually. Yep, that's a guaranteed kill. Now, uh, I'm gonna have Hans do nothing and just kind of stand there. That one's crying. Give me some, yeah, give me some blue. Give me some of that good blue. I'm gonna swap here, do another cleave on these two, killing that one instantly. And then it's just this nasty fuck left. Move in, do a smack. Boom, 10 damage. Oh fuck. Do something, quick! We're fine. We're not overflowing yet, everything's fine, guys. We're gonna be good. We're gonna win right now, it's over. I mean, I feel like I'm doing pretty good for my first, uh, first lap on stream here. Though I haven't gained any new friends, which is tragic. But, uh, I'm gonna level up. I level up Hans, which means I have two new moves updated. Sturdy Mend is just more healing now. And Frail is too frail. And I heal, and I heal Hans. Okay. Loot! More money. And I just don't want to deal with that. I just don't want to do that. I don't want to deal with that guy. Uh, all right. That guy's going to transform right away. So unless I can get us both in a position to fucking thrash this guy. Actually, I can. I got this dude in one move. Oh. He's gone. Now it's just this guy who's just going to shield for their turn. Uh, yep, end turn. He's just going to shield. Drippings of the Garden. And then he moved out of the way of his only shield. Okay. Fucking kill him. Fucking kill him, put him down. This guy's done. Uh, yeah, I'll do the cleave. And then I'm gonna have Hans do a heal on these two. Very good. Very good. Yeah, this guy's not much of anything. This guy's nothing, guys. We don't have to worry about him. He's basically dead. We got him. You know, I never really noticed Hans from the, like, back. I always thought they looked kind of like a flower, but they're actually like a nasty, like, pile of meat. Like, did you see that when they were looking at, like, towards the, like, background? They were like a nasty pile of meat. Hang on, I got an item here. You have obtained defaced scripture. Inflict curse on the opposing enemy at the end of each turn. Deal seven damage to the opposing enemy if they are cursed at the end of each turn. Wait, that sounds insane. I feel like that's really good on our boy. On our little guy. Who's this? Holy heck. Who the hell are you? Hello. No. You didn't even know what I was going to say. You want me to join you on your little crusade. I've seen your types before. I can see in your eyes. You don't even know what you're doing. I know exactly what I'm doing. You'll give up like all the rest. It's best if you just accept that now and find a respectable resting place. This place doesn't have to be a hell. You only make it worse by fighting it. Hello again. The look he gives you ends the conversation before it starts. All right, man, chill. I'll see you later. I'm gonna go ahead and... Uh, am I max level with everyone? I am. I don't think there's much reason to postpone the inevitable then. I don't want to fight him. The Ouroboros. Oh. Oh, what the fuck is that? What is that, Baney? It's pulsing. Kill it. <laughs> Fucking kill it. All right, so it's moves, move all party members left. We want to avoid the head then, guys, is what it seems like. 
I feel like I need to move over here to get hits on the red spot while it's here. So I can build pigment. Now we can cleave with Boyle and then move him down the line too. Get a hit on both of them. And we'll have blue and I can heal with Hans. Okay. Heal. We gotta stay away from that mouth! Ha <laughs> ha! That enemy has been cursed. Curse is a slow death. They can no longer be healed for the rest of combat. Now's the time to strike. Okay. Ouch. That was uh, five damage each. Good news is we have enough blue to heal again. Um, yeah, I'm gonna build more red. Hans, do something! I want to do another cleave, but I want it to be in the spot where I'm going to do full damage. I have to! Papa! Okay. I win. What? The corpse dying and withering. Okay, that means we're not going to move this turn, it looks like, so we're good. Okay. Do I have any more moves left? No. I could technically move there. Um, I think I want to move Noak here into the shield, just in case. Okay, he still has a bite move, but we don't move. And he, he's a two-slot enemy. Okay. I thought this area would be safe, like this line, but I was wrong. Okay. I would like to do another cleave in a second. God, I really want time to use my wrath thing because I think that boosts of that gives me a focus. But I feel like I just need to do damage and build essence, you know. Oh, the overflow! The whole red overflow! We didn't even get the red off of that! Heal, hounds! Heal! Heal them! Or actually just heal whoever burns the most slots! Okay, we got the red back. Oh shit. Oh, he, oh, he kissed me. Okay. Okay. Give me a kiss. Maybe, maybe things aren't so bad after all. Anyways, uh, I'm gonna move to the tail and fucking kill it for, uh, well, no, I need to. I'm gonna have so much overflow, dude. Here's what we do. You wanna see how we do this? I'm about to pop off. Frailty. Frailty on this guy. Then, swap with Noak. 20 damage. Then, because it's too frailty, swap with Boil. We have six shield on that spot, and as long as Boyle's always at the front, we're gonna keep blocking his attacks. Skullcracker him. We're gonna take a bunch of damage on top, but we're gonna do a bunch of damage to him. Boom! 28 damage! We only take four. Hot! We'll heal on his next turn. He can't move farther up, but we're gonna move- we're gonna leave him here. And he's gonna curse them. Oh, shit! Oh, oh! Wait. It's okay? It's bad? Wait, it's bad? It's really bad? I lived, bitch. Hey, I lived. You know what that means? You're fucking dead. Hey, hey you. It's over. Frailty, I'm gonna end this. Yep. Boom. And uh, this should kill him. Simple as that, baby! Woo! Easy! He tanked the insta-death attack. Sometimes it's that simple. A million dollars. You unlocked the firstborn. Lil Oro. And Strange Fruit. What the hell is this? You unlocked Box of Metal. What is this? 
Bosch is shaking visibly. Is this it? Just beat the game in one try, guys. Too easy. This is it. That thing. You have to understand it's too dangerous to let live. Even for a moment. It is a malformed child of unspeakable sins. Please show no mercy. No matter how much it hurts. So this is the man who killed me? I have to ask him why- No! This thing is no man! Its words are a poison you cannot possibly overcome. Promise me you will destroy it. I promise. The pitiful corpse. Uh, hang on. Whoa, 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 guys. Hang on. On his turn, he's gonna attack. Wait, himself. Wait, is that true? He's gonna attack himself? This is a trap. Kill him, anyways, I don't care. Owned, I win, dude. Rip Mozo, dude. Huh? Wait, guys, no! Hans! Guys? Bad ending L. Guys, it's the first ending of Binding of Isaac style, all right? Like, come on. You're never gonna win the roguelike on your first time getting to the final boss. Give me a break. That's not how roguelikes work. You unlocked dried paint. You run. Uh, okay, so we get a random selection of our assortment of companions, of which we only have two. Oh, they have different starting things. So with this one, they get simple weave, heal left and right allies three health, and heal this party member for one health, and one frail to the opposing person. This one is both heals, and this is left and normal party member and frail. The frail's really good, but it's hard to like... Honestly, I'd like the one that's uh, gonna give me the, a the full AoE. I, but uh, I like the one I had, you know what? I like the one I had. And what about you? Apply three, deals three damage to opposing enemy. Apply four shield to this current party member. Eight damage. Or five to left and right and eight to opposing. Dude, honestly, I would like the one where I have cleave and I have a shield move. That sounds really good. Nowak doesn't get one. Okay, Nowak does not. Oh, we only get to pick one guy. Let's just random both of it. Who cares? All right, let's head out. Noak, you okay? You're trembling. Oh, Where were we a moment ago? For an almost imperceptible moment, panic flickers behind Bo's eyes. What? Here, I guess. What are you on about? You make eye contact with Bosch, searching for a chink in his armor, fear in the calm. Something quiet but immutable inside of yourself speaks. He lies to yourself. Oh, yeah. Reject the death he seeks. Reject all horizons. Yeah. Let's head out. I'm not going to get revenge just waiting around. Yeah. <laughs> that flicker of panic returns to Bosch's eyes. Who's this guy? Yo, we got a freaking... Yo, we got a gang of freaking gimps over here, dude. A crowd of strange men clad in leather speak in obscenities to each other. Whoa, uh, Noak, what did you just walk oh. us into? Hi. What are you guys up to? <laughs> the tallest of the three men slaps him in the back of the head to shut him up. We're explorers of the terrible and beautiful things that lurk inside. Oh. Well, we're explorers as well. 
Bosch signals you to shut up. You guys want to come with us? Bosch slumps in embarrassment. You must understand. You are still invested in this physical world. You wish to explore this, the thing we're working to escape. Yeah, yeah you would... With a look, he silences the others. I could see in your eyes that you're but a pathetic whelp. And like a whelp, you desperately suckle for attention from anyone more competent you can find. Run along. I'm sure whatever abomination turns you inside out will have lots of fun playing with your gaudy bones. With a chuckle, the group turns away from you. I'm gonna punch him in the face. Gaudy? You clench your hand into a fist. Yo, whack. You start walking towards the trio. This is a bad idea. Abort mission! Abort mission! As the moment arrives, you swing, aiming to strike the tallest in the back of the head. He turns effortlessly and catches your fist with his remaining arm before the strike can land. There's an interest deep in his eye. Passionate, aren't you? It's nigh invisible, but you can tell he's impressed. You were just going to take on all three of us. You match his glare. You didn't think this through at all, did you? Just all emotion? He releases your hand. Hmm. You're an idiot. Oh, but I think you're the kind of idiot I've been looking for. Lead the way, and I think I'll follow. What? Mm -hmm. What about us? That is definitely and absolutely not my problem. Seriously? I said scram! On cue, they begin to flee. All right, golden boy. Let's find out how you die. Burnout has become an ally. That was the easiest ally I've gained all day. Holy shit, new best friend. What does he do? Slap, the usual knuckle buster. Deal eight damage to the opposing enemy. 40% chance to refresh this party member. Okay, I think that means I get another turn. Decrease Knuckle Buster's damage by one to two if this party member gets refreshed. That's insane! For one red? And what's his other move? Lame exit. This party member will f flee at the end of this turn. Refresh this party member. Restore sudden decimation and Knuckle Buster's damage to normal. This attack only works once. Okay, so if I'm like last move of the fight, I can refresh him one more time and then he fucking leaves for the rest of the fight. Okay, I mean, that's still really good. That's insane. That guy's cracked. This guy. Wow. I really hope there's a god. Otherwise, this is all really a lot to take in. <laughs> I have the weirdest anxiety right now. Okay, dude, well, hey man, you have a good time with that. I'll see you later. Three little fish to kill. Little idiots. Look at them. Look at them. They have no idea they're about to die. Kill them. Oh! Alright, next up. Da Cleave. Oh! Which tragically doesn't instantly kill. Oh well. Move him out of the way. And then you give him the bop. Not bad. Wait, he, he's got another move. Dude, that's crazy. 40% chance to get another turn. That's cracked. That guy's insane. Actually busted. Oh, this guy's back. Wait, I I, I don't have any... Ugh, he's not going to want to talk to me. I haven't lost anyone. Maybe, maybe it counts anyways. I mean, I suffered great loss. Experience loss worthy of our presence. I want to come with you, but I don't have the final say. Okay, fuck. Let me get some. Let me get an item. You have obtained strange fruit. Adds cannibalize as an additional ability, a powerful self-healing ability that feeds off your enemies and allies. Uh, I guess give it to uh, give it to our boy, Boyle. Wait, who's this guy again? This is the guy that talks in freaking like silly voice. Baloo bibbidi badias, Vevador. What? Vedi vedi fasim. Sokoko mejidar abbargo. Zebi. 
Okay, we can't do anything about that guy. He's just weird. Zebby. This sucks. This place sucks. What did I what did I just walk into? Okay, forward attack on them, forward attack on them, and he's gonna do a shield. Okay, let's build uh let's build some red. And that slides them over here. I'm gonna have Burnout do his thing. And maybe we'll refresh. We did. Okay, kill him. Boom! Dead in one, dude. There's another guy. Okay. Well, um... Here's what I do now. I move Boyle here. And he does his cleave. I forgot that this guy was going to do a forward attack, but it doesn't look like it's going to do a lot of damage. So I'll just move, uh... Hans into position to heal afterwards. It's fine. That looks like it does a lot of damage. The animation didn't give me confidence that it wasn't doing a lot of damage, though. What the fuck? He ate everything! My blue! That was for Hans! Whatever. Kill this freak. Or do I do the cleave? Oh, wait. Oh, I'm clicked on the wrong guy. Ah. Uh, we get a heal if I do this, so I'm gonna do the cleave. Oh, wait, I only get the red if I actually hit through the shield. Okay. Things have been learned, guys. Things have been learned. It's fine. Is this a forward attack? No, it's a cleave. I gotta kill this guy. Ow! I forgot I got that rupture on me! It's fine. On my next turn, I'll heal with Hans. As soon as this flarb is done eating all of my frickin' pigments. Okay. Uh... Noek, move here, kill him. Perfect. We won't have a heal right now, but Burnout should be able to finish the job. Burnout's not gonna die, guys. I, I, it was a minor fuck up. Okay, he's gonna be fine. Now I will need to farm some more items off of these fools. So I'm gonna kill some more of these silly mud, mud lungs. Okay, that is on the table. I do need to kill more mud lungs. So let's just stay focused. I'm gonna swap with Boyle so he's in position for a clean. Good. Yeah, we're gonna cleave immediately. Kill the one in front of, in front of our boy. Good. That one's the only one that's not gonna be attacking the front. So we're gonna leave him as he is. And he moves the last, so he's not gonna reposition anyone and fuck us up. Burn out, kill this one. Refresh your abilities. Yes. Dude, this guy's cracked. I love Burnout. He's great. And that gives uh, Hans enough to heal on the next turn. Because he's only going to consume one pigment, so he's fine. Uh, I think, does Fra let's see if Frail goes, no, then I'll lose my blue. Who's going to attack? Move him over there so we don't get hit. I don't know if Frail goes away if no one uses it on a turn, if it lasts another turn. You know? I'm not sure on that. Oh well. Let's use all the moves we have on Burnout first. Now you heal. Heal him. Yes, very good. I do not like the animation Hans has for healing. It makes me uncomfortable. I do not like the lick. Okay, we're just gonna fill for this. Kill that guy before he attacks. How much is that? Like a tiny bit of damage? Yeah, one damage, that's fine. 
Okay. We got these guys on the next round. It's over. Burn out, kill him. Yes. How about you refresh too? I want you to kill the next guy as well. Kill him. Refresh again. Okay, never mind. All right, just kill it. The only issue with burnout is I gotta be really careful I don't build up too much red. Cause we're overflowing bad off of this. Uh, rib cracker, okay, I have a straightforward attack. I just have to move like this. He's gonna overflow us. Aside from that, we're doing pretty good. Item. You have obtained Gambler's Right Hand. Upon receiving direct damage, this party member will either receive full damage, no damage, or double damage. Oh, yeah. Put that right on our boy. And level up Nowak. Actually, level up freaking Burnout first. Nice. Okay. Still feel like I want to upgrade my characters more before we fight the boss, so I'm gonna kill everything I can. Uh, we still get a free kill on this guy. Easy. Burnout might just be able to instantly kill this guy. Boom. Jesus fucking Christ! Well. Yeah, upgrading him was worth it. Yeah, we're gonna be clearing pretty quick with Burnout. Until we have to do a long fight like a boss. Ten bucks! Level up no whack next. And uh, now we go fight the nasty boys. We fight the nasty worm. Which does a slightly heals all enemies and randomly moves all enemies. Okay, this guy's gonna light us all on fire. We wanna kill him. Uh, but first I think I hit this guy so we have so we know that uh, I have some red on hand. Alright, burnout. Uh refresh and kill this guy in one turn, okay? Thank you. He did! He followed my instructions! He refreshed again again. Okay, in that case, Hans, move here and build more red so burnout can kill again. Dude, this is actually fucking crack. Okay. Also dead. Will he refresh again? No. Is that- what's this little guy? Goa. He's gonna blush? Or weep? Okay, he doesn't do anything but make blue. That's fine. We'll let him make blue and then I can get, um... A heal off. And turn. Give that blue back now. I need him to weep so I can. Damn it, he's gonna take all of my pigment. Let's just kill him. I was gonna heal. Put him down. Goodbye. Ah. Uh... If I'm gonna go to the shop, I'd want to kill another Flarb. Okay, this fight's gonna suck eggs. Guys, we're fucking dead. It's over. Boy, this is gonna suck. Uh... I thought it would be what- I was thinking of like one Flarb. You know, and like nothing else. Okay, build red. This all- all of this hinges on burnout killing everything that moves. So, let's let him do his thing. Kill that guy first. Refresh. Burnout, refresh. Re refresh. Okay. He's not refreshing. Uh, how much damage would this do? Eight? It's not enough to kill. Okay, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna beat the crap out of this guy and just move out of the way. Oh, I moved him out of the way. Okay. Well, that actually worked out really good for me. All right, Hans, give this guy a hearty slap. Okay. We win this fight, it's over. We win, guys. My 
Pikmin! My money! Fuck! Kill that baby! Okay, he's gonna do a double forward. We need this guy killed. We're gonna do a cleave attack on both of them, which will clear the way. Dude didn't punch through the fucking red. That's, oh. I mean, well, he would've only given yellow actually anyways. This is bad though. Um, I'm gonna move. Fuck, I gotta move Hanj out of the way. And you know what I'm gonna? There's nothing I can do about. Someone's gonna have to take some damage. Okay, but if I choose, I'd like it to be boil. Although then we'd get red if- Wait a minute. We get red if this guy gets hit. We get- Leave it, leave it, let it roll. We get red if he gets hit, which means he'll be able to- Oh! Never mind, he gets no damage! Gambler's right hand, motherfucker! Pathetic! Kill him! Put him down! Uh, he's gonna do another forward attack there. We only- Dude, I really don't want to be taking self-damage. But if Noak gets another hit, he just instantly kills. So... I'm kind of... Dude? Fucking gamble, dude. This guy's gonna be fine. You know what? It's fine. Because now, he has everything he needs to kill. That worked out. Kill him. Put him in the ground. Noak, finish the job. All we don't want is double. That's all. But we got him. Perfect. Rank up. Boil next. Now, another chest. Which will hopefully, nine coins, allow me to rank up hearts. Dude, an excellent roll. An excellent roll. We're doing great. Stuff is going swimmingly. Let's go to the shop. For free? <laughs> wait, 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 for free? Use bandages for free. Uh, what else we got? At the end of the turn, if there's an overflow pigment, consume one to five pigment from the pig- That's actually insane. Take that immediately. Put that down on one of them. Put that on you. 50% chance to heal one health this party member at the end of each turn. Actually, put that on Noak. Put that on Hans. Okay. I mean, I feel like I should try to earn money. So, killing these guys is good. For free. We get used managers for free, man. What are the odds? All right, everyone's gonna do a forward attack, but this guy's gonna do like a burn, so we're gonna try to kill him first. Uh, if I do this, I'll get even more mileage. I mean, hell, as it is, if, if all goes well, burnout kills everyone on this map, but before he does, I would like Hans to perform a heal. Yes. Very good, Hans. Now, you first. Dispatch. Refresh. Refresh. There it is. Good. I forgot that he'd have to move, but that's okay, because we're gonna swap him like that, baby. Kill that one, too. Simple as that. Go ahead and dance around, you nasty worm. Kill him. Put him in the ground. Put him down. Boom, bam. Refresh. Keep on thinking if I say it, it'll just happen every time. But I don't think it's that easy, guys. I don't think it's that simple. Nasty bastard. Put it down. Deal one direct indirect damage to all other party members. Deal two indirect damage to all enemies. That's actually insane. 
Dude, my spine cracker does 11 damage. Jesus. Boyle does some damage too, guys. We're sleeping on Boyle. Who's this clown? <laughs> I guess I did want to live after all. You choose not to interrupt their thousand yard stare. All we have left is this. What is that, a heart on their face? Maybe this guy won't be that bad. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh, what is that? That a huge man? Guys, that looks like a huge man. <laughs> Voids? Oh, fuck. He's got a lot of turns in a row, guys. Guys, this man's got a lot of turns in a row. Okay. Well, I'm gonna just start hitting him. Eight damage. And he loses a turn because of overexert. Hang on. Upon receiving two or more direct damage, cancels one of Roid's abilities. Okay, so as long as I'm doing constant damage to him, we'll be okay. So, Hans! Wait, two direct damage. That means he won't... Wait a minute, that means a slap wouldn't do it. But what I can do... No, but then I wouldn't... Does he have slap? No, my best bet is to move Burnout in and helpfully Burnout does a million fucking damage with Refresh. Refresh! Damn you, Burnout, you fuck up! You trash! We're fucked. Hang on, here's what we do. I... I'm gonna try to limit the amount of turns this takes. So I'm gonna do... Move Nowak there. Move you in. And I have you burn an extra... thing to frail him. And now Boyle is gonna do maximum damage on this guy, despite the fact that he's gonna take a lot of damage as a result on top of it. 22. He'll take four. And now this guy only has two turns. Zero damage! Okay, he's got skittish, so he moves after every turn, so we can't predict too much, but I think we have him regardless this turn now. Boom, bam. Refresh. That's what we like to see. Put him down, burn out. Hey, burn out. Refresh again. Kill him. Jesus fucking Christ. He's a god. He's a combat god. Unlocked a new item, let's roll. Wicker child. I'm gonna take the item chest, and while that's happening, we're gonna immediately upgrade burnout again. 50% chance now to refresh and 10 damage. Yup. And now the edge the exit only costs one purple. That's crazy. Heal this party member 40% of their ma- Ooh! <laughs> That goes on burnout, dude. Gambler's hand is really good. That one's better, dude. That's insane. Oh, this guy's back. Hello again. Still fighting it. I'm not gonna justify myself to you. I can't just give up. I remember feeling like that. That feeling. That feeling that if you just push a little further, you'll make it. It'll eat you alive. I know you won't give up, and I know there's a chance you'll make it, but that's the worst part. You're a slave to that potential. Mm. Just make sure this path is what you want. Okay. Hi. I'm gonna level up one of my guys again if I'm lucky. Six coins. That was not, a lo that was not enough to level up, guys. I'm gonna fight one of these nasty boys. Lots of music men out here, guys. I need to get some heels in. 
Uh, these two are both gonna cleave. Oh wait, no, they just move me when I when they hit. Me. Okay. Well, no reason to not go after the one right in front of me. We're just here to build red, after all. Okay, burn out. Do your thing. Ten damage. He didn't refresh. That's so fucking tragic, but it's fine. Do an AOE heal. Does that hit everyone? That does. Heal everyone in the group. Gigantic man. My god. This party is something else. Oil. Uh, which one of these guys has a guaranteed hit? Yeah, get rid of the one that's about to ha attack Hans. Or, like, get in get in the way and punch him. Punch him good once, please. Five. We can take five. Five. We can take five, because he's about to heal for 40% of his health on his next turn. Got a good variety of blues. I mean, this is great for us. I'll take all these. We are going to burn all this very quickly. I need to move you in. I'm going to wait until the end of the turn to do that. Brutal takedown. We do 10 damage guaranteed, so we want to move here. Do the 10 damage guarantee on this guy. Kill him. Heal off of it. Six damage? Oh my god. Jesus! Alright. Swap here. You don't have any more moves. Do the cleave. No whack. We'll get another hit on this guy. This one's the only one that's... Hey, guys, that overflow is not ideal, though, is the thing. The overflow is uh, only going to be slightly eaten. So... Yeah, Boyle's gonna have to move here. This guy's gonna have to take the hit. But we're gonna do an AoE heal on the group. Because we'll have some of it eaten by the paint. By my item. Okay, nice. Yeah, that dried paint is crazy. Okay, I don't have to worry too much about it. That's good. I didn't know how bad it was gonna be. Oh boy, it is bad though. It is. There is a lot of overflow. Uh, burnout builds a lot of overflow on the party. Refresh. He's also not refreshing very much today, which is bad. Okay, Noak, have him get a kill. Boom. And you know what, Hans? You've never gotten a kill, have you, little guy? Do you feel it? Do you feel the bloodlust? Are you feeling it now? What's that? Some weird fucking plants. That's a uh, hollowing jumble guts. That's a waning jumble guts. And that's a flummoxing jumble guts. None of them give red, which is so fucking bad. Guys. <laughs> Guys, that's really bad for burnout and boil. Fuck. Okay, well, this one's gonna curse us. So we kind of have to kill it, even if it takes damage. Wait. Hold up. If Burnout gets the kill, he heals off of all of his self-damage he inflicts. He did not refresh. That's fine. He'll get a guaranteed kill next time off of it. Can I? One more of these and I can activate my bonus on top of it. You can use Writhing Wrath. Okay. Uh, we just need to use whatever we can to kill this guy before he curses us. So we're- <gasps> Fucking Boyle's gonna get owned, dude, but we need to get rid of the enemy. Oh! It's fine. Because we're gonna have you do a heal too. And heal Boyle for some, it's fine. He'll only take two damage. He'll self-heal himself with the bandages. Stop. They're giving me useless orbs! Stop! These, these, all these colors are trash!
Okay, well, I can do this one again, which is cool. Swap to here and do an AoE heal. Perfect. Now, Noak's gonna move here and kill. Good. Someone's gotta do the uh, damage on this, and I'm gonna have it be Burnout, because at the very least, if he somehow gets the kill, he'll full heal for everything he took. Refreshed once. Chase him. Chase him. He refreshed again. But I can't move. Wait. Inflict one fire to all enemy enemies. Refresh this party member. Restore total destiny. Okay. No, that won't work, but I could do some damage. It's the best I could do. Whoa, you lit them on fire. As long as they stay in the fire, they'll burn to a crisp. Careful, they might try to escape the fire. Every part of the map is a fire. Yeah, not much I can do to chase him, but he is gonna burn. Bye. I killed him. Whoa, that's insane. Dude, burnout's fucked. Jesus. Still feels like the next guy I want to upgrade is always Nowak, because he's got the best opener in the game. Uh, his, his, like, second ability is trash, though. Like, the parry is good. The normal takedown is awesome. And the wrath ability is kind of bad. Like, it just gives focus, but that's a whole turn you're wasting. I'm not sure it's very good. I don't think it's going to be something I ever really use. Okay, this is going to be good for me. Kill this guy. Kill the music man. Kill him now. Uh, first of all... Move Nowak there. And build the red. Okay. Then move Burn out there. And finish him. Get yourself a heal. Very good. Now you, hit him with the spine cracker. Now, Noak is gonna get hit by this attack, but it's a very low damage attack. I'm gonna have Hans do another AOE heal on the group. Very nice. How much damage is it? Four? Yeah, it's nothing, we're fine. We're good. Finish this now. Ten damage off of that. Someone's gonna have to take the uh, required damage here, but Burnout will heal off of it, so just have him do it. Wait a minute, that's bullshit! Wait, he takes his self damage after he fucking does the. Whatever. Who's this idiot? A bloated corpse buzzes with flies in front of you. Whoa, what's going on with that guy? The corpse? It's just a corpse. You know, dead. Yeah, yeah, I know, but why is it rotting? Have we seen anything else rot down here? Like, things fall apart, but rot? So weird. Can we take it with us? What? No. Why not? Take a guess. Your first guess is correct. I don't know, it just seems important. Let's come back to this body later. There's just something about it. Okay. Bye. There's something about the body. We're leaving now. What the fuck is this shit? Oh, this- Oh, what the fuck? Scrungies? Dude, we're dead. That's a fucking army of Scrungies over there. And they're pissed off. They're doing full AOE attacks on the entire party. We are doomed. We have to clear. We have to kill these ads. Pronto. Wait, they got overexerted. Wait, if they get, if they overexert, they don't actually do their move. Okay, cool. I really want Burnout to refresh properly one of these days. He's not been doing that, and it's uh. 
fucking tragic. Okay. Yeah, not much of anything to do here, but I will have Han slap the shit out of this freaking waning jumble guts. Slap him right into that slot over there that no one's in. We'll always have Hans engage in slap. Man, Boyle's getting chewed up, but I don't really know what to do about it. Uh... Yeah, let's kill this guy. Boom. Then I'm gonna have our boy move over here and do an AOE heal. Yes. Then I'm gonna have Boyle, actually I'm gonna have a Burnout lead here and do their attacks first. Boom, bam. Refresh, now. Why doesn't he refresh anymore, man? What happened to him? Do I have any extra moves? I need to get out of this fire. But I'd really like to attack the AO. I, it's better to have, it's better to take the fire damage if it means we break this. I'm gonna take the extra damage and kill this guy, or try to. Do as much damage as possible. That's a lot of yellow. Sitting on a lot of yellow on this uh, team so far. Lots of yellow pigment. 50% is worse than 40%? Who knew? It feels bad, dude. Burnout should be refreshing every 10 seconds. Refresh! He never gets it, dude. What the fuck? It's bullshit. Kill him. The overflow is bad. Kill him. Just get out of here. Guys, I remember before Burnout was washed the fuck up. He's a mess now. He's trash. He used to be one of the strongest characters in the game and now he's garbage. Funnel helmet. On turn end, apply five shield to this party member's position if this party member has no shield. That's kind of good. I think that's better than funnel helmet. Or better than bandages. Also, I haven't used the cannibalism move. Maybe I should. I don't know what that is. I don't want to know. I'm going to go to the shop and see if there's anything good to buy. Fucking absolutely annihilate this stage, dude. Certificate of Exemption. Dodge more than the draft. Wrong pigment can be used without dealing damage to self. Receiving direct or indirect damage destroys this item. I feel like this is fun for about 10 seconds, but... On, like, Hans, this could be absolutely insane for just, like, constant output on healing. First aid. Heal this party member one health at the end of each turn. Mm. Buy it. As long as I never fuck up. That could be cracked. I'm also going to give the shield to, uh, Boil. I'm going to fight this freak. How bad could they be? Look at them, they look like a little idiot. The smooth skin. Huh? Guys, I don't feel good. Guys, I don't feel great. Guys, I'm not feeling great and I feel like instantaneously uh, I'm gonna lose my buff on Hans. Okay, hang on. So I just... These two have barely any health. Mother's visage, father's visage. Do I just... I mean, I'm gonna fucking move into the middle with Boyle in a second and build some fucking points. But first, I need Nowak here. This guy attack... Okay, so Tough Love, he's gonna attack... Left, right. Okay, I gotta break him. I'm gonna move Nowak here. Hans is gonna lose his fucking move immediately, dude. I'm gonna move Hans over here so he's out of the fucking way. I do not want him to get hit on the first round with that fucking thing. But I'm gonna hit this guy. It's 
specifically to build red. Then I'm gonna move boil here to cleave, get more red and blue. Good. And now, if I move burn out here, he could just fucking die. Do I wait a turn and just not? Deals an agonizing amount of damage to the opposing party member. Moves this enemy to the left or- <gasps> Y'all wanna see Burnout hit 500,000 attacks in a row and instantly kill this doofus and keep us from wiping with Noak dying immediately? Y'all wanna see Burnout hit 50 coin flips? In one move? Y'all wanna see me pop off? Boom, bam. Refresh. Once more. Boom, bam. Refresh. Burnout, I said refresh. <laughs> He'll live. Oh! Oh, he missed the second attack. Wait, 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 this is great. He healed me and frailed. Oh my god. Well, we got frail for next round. That's bad. What's it? A band applies one shield to all possible positions and then obliterates his visage. Well, leave him. Yeah, I don't care about them. Fucking kill this fucking idiot. Deals painful damage. Okay, so everything's attacking them. We're just gonna fucking bum rush this dude. Kill him. Best we can right now. Boom, bam. Refresh. Do something! Burnout's not doing fucking anything! Here's what we do. We've got a million points for this. Give this guy frailty. We're gonna try to fucking bum rush kill him right now. No work. Move in. Boom. Bam. 20 damage. Boil. Move into the spot. Full power, kill him! 11 more damage. They're gonna get a bunch of shield off of this shit, but hopefully it won't be too bad. Okay, he's doing it again. Guys. Once you're caught in that chain, you're stuck. Entrapped, if you will, constricted to be precise. You cannot escape on your own, but someone else can swap in to take your place. It should wear off unless something is keeping you restricted. Why? Dude, I'm just gonna fucking bum rush killing this guy. He doesn't have that much health left. If I move Hans into that spot, I can have Burnout move over there and refresh with his, like, upgrade and then bail at the end of the turn, and he wins. Watch this. Boom. Bam. Burnout's gonna use explosive exit. Fill for it. And then he's gonna beat the shit out of this guy. And then Noak will finish it. Dead. Refresh. Again. It's as simple as that, baby. It's as simple as that, baby. You unlocked the unfortunate prophecy. This can now be found in a chest. Okay. Why do I feel like, uh, I should be more careful with what I do this time? Oh, she's shaking visibly. Is this it? This is it, that thing. You have to understand, it's too dangerous to let live, even for a moment. It's a malformed child of unspeakable sins. Please show no mercy, no matter how much it hurts. So this is the man who killed me? I have to ask him why- No! This thing is no man! It's words! Are a poison you cannot possibly overcome. Promise me you'll destroy it. I, I promise. But really, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna let him live. End turn.
Hey, uh, he's... He's dying all on, on his own over there. I don't really... Noah! What are you doing? I... You've always been a waste! You sniveling mass of failure crudely shaped into a man! Bo sh sharply inhales. Why can't you let us have this? Why can't you do this one thing right? Bosch's voice is choked with rage. He doesn't deserve to die. This thing is just a kid. Even if they wrong me, they don't deserve- Ah! Everything we have done merits oblivion! Why won't you just let us die? Why won't you just let go? You crack our skull, bleed us in this pit, and won't even grant us mercy. If you don't- if you won't do what's right, I will! Make me do what? You've barked orders at me since the start. Boast, you're barely a bastard, let alone a man. I want to see you try to accomplish any of what I've done. You wouldn't even- I am, Noack, you relentless parasite! And I'll not let you violate it, this name any longer. Whoa, what was that? You're going to regret this, the game just got harder. Oh. Okay. That doesn't sound good. Wait, where am I? Shut up! What was that? Uh, did I? What the? Can I go back inside and play now? No. Stop! I... <sighs> I'm kidding. Hang on, guys. One more second. Hey. Please just... You don't... Killing you is almost as exhausting as dealing with you. We're not getting anywhere. No. You're making... Yeah. Stop talking. You've had all the chances to speak. Now you will listen. You are a waste of flesh. And now dead, you've proven you are, by your very nature, a waste of space. I'm leaving. Unfortunately, not forever. I'm beginning to suspect my lapse in concentration may have revealed us to intruding powers. Uh. Intruding powers? Bosch ignores your question. Oh, yeah. You need to think about what you've done. In the meantime, I'll see if anything can be done to counter this escalation. Before I leave, I'll remind you, we're both still bound to each other, not by blood, but by being itself. There's no circumventing this, no matter how badly we may want it. Bosch begins draining away. Wait, w what do you mean you're no whack? Bosch is already gone. Okay, bye. Guys, I don't know where to go if he's not here. Wait, hang on. Hang on, wait. Wait, he was my he was my GPS. Help! 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 Burnout? Hans? Oh, hey. Do you hear that? Oh, it almost sounds like music. The guitar seems to play itself even when his hands are removed from the strings. Almost. I, I thought it sounded nice. Yeah, <laughs> but does that make it music? Either way, I appreciate you saying so. You look hey. troubled. Are you? No. Yeah, yeah, I am. May I take a guess? No. Sure. Don't know who you are anymore and your deal with the devil went south. Hey. That's... How did you know that? <laughs> Well, a broken clock is right twice. And if a clock can muster that, then you'd be shocked by what a broken person can do. So this devil, you have a name? A uh, Bosch. Like the painter? The painter? Hieronymus Bosch. Famed artist of scary nonsense. Ears with knives sprouting out from them. Birds with cauldrons on their heads. Lots of naked people for some reason. Ring any bells? I, I had forgotten about Bosch. The real Bosch, that is. Why, why does it hurt to think about him? Nowak is choking on his own breath. <laughs> Easy. Maybe just tell me about yourself instead. If you had none of these worries, and could just go to your happy place, what would that be like? I, I don't know. I, I think I worked. I think I gutted fish. I would cut fish apart with someone. I think they were my father. You enjoy cutting up fish? No, I hated it. I always had this intrusive thought of some fish cutting me apart, pulling out my insides. So then you dodged my question. What do you do for fun? I, I think I would paint little little pictures. 
Oh, a creative. What would you paint? I spent so much time making my own paints. I painted creatures and places that didn't exist. I painted my own little world. Why are all the specifics so fuzzy? Let's talk about Bosch again for a second, the demon. Would you say he's also a creative? I think so. <laughs> what makes you say that? I don't know. Hmm. Have you ever loaned yourself money? What? Why would I? You ever ask yourself to move out of the way because you were blocking the view? No, that doesn't make any sense. I wouldn't do any of that. I mean, it's myself. I just do it. Hmm. Yeah, you just do it. You ever ask yourself a question? No, why would you? You already know the answer. But you have, haven't you? I have. You see, we're not quite as unified as we like to think. I think this devil, this Bosch, might be you asking yourself a question the hard way. I think you need to tell yourself how you feel. You're only insane if you don't know you're talking to yourself. Knowing that reflection is you just makes you aware. Do you hear that? It's music. Funny. All it took was recognizing it always was. I have to leave. I have to go talk to him before this gets worse, but thanks. I think I'm better for having crossed paths with you. Oh, kid, we never cross paths. We've just been in the same place. Okay, bye, strange campfire man. Oh, that was easy. Bosh, we need to talk. I need to understand what we are. What any of this down here even means. Bosh? It's over. They're here. Who's here? Intruders. What, what do you mean, intruders? No whack, it's over. All of these little games have been fun, but there's no more chance for peace. You threw that out the window. What's come for us is unstoppable. An unfathomable unknown is now hunting us. We are wholly at its mercy. What? Well, I don't care about any of that. Bosh, stop calling me that. I'm no less than you. You have no right to that name above me. What are you... I don't know. I was shocked that you didn't recognize me. It was silly, but in my dreams, when we'd finally speak, you'd explain to me what I was. But I've always been watching. I was always there for you, and I thought that was mutual. I don't understand. I don't know what you're talking about. When we fell, when we split our skull open, I was in agony. I felt that every moment of it. For hours, we bled, and you laid there silent. Finally, you spoke. You dragged us into this strange dream, but I don't want to dream. I just want to be done. I'm not sorry for trying to mislead you. You've controlled me our whole life. What I did was no less cruel than what you subjected us to. I, I can't remember. I know. That's the cruelest part. It seems at the end only I remember the life we lived. I'm sorry. I know. Are we dead? No, but death is very close. We have but a matter of hours to minutes. Did we want to die? It doesn't matter anymore, and I don't know. What, what do we even do? I don't know what awaits us if the intruder claims us. These intruders, they're not like everything else down here. They're real in an existential sense I can't properly describe. I don't pretend to understand what they threaten us with. I can lead you to that deepest place where it resides. I must warn you that place is a hateful and vile realm of everything will never be. Everything will never accomplish. The idols will never match. Perhaps there's some fleeting hope we could overcome it. But that's all it is. A hope. I, we will find peace, no matter what the cost. Noak, I, I promise us this. Okay. Guys, back to hanging out with Hans. <laughs> Guys, everyone stop giving a shit about the plot. We got Hans back. Thank God, none of this matters. All right, guys, hear me out, though. Burnout's the character we're bringing with us. Yep. Seven dollars. And fish battle. Oh, we, wait, we got Hans. Thank God. Thank God.
Guys, everything is gonna be okay. Hans is still in the game. We didn't lose him. There's still hope for us yet in these trying times. I think I just kind of hang out this turn. Holy heck, this game is awesome. It's a very cool game. I am a big fan. Fish is gonna attack forward. We're gonna kill this one with the smacks. Boom, bam, refresh. Boom, easy, kill him. Put him down. Refresh again. Unfortunately, I can't move over there, but Nowak might be able to kill him. No, he'll only do eight damage. We'll let it roll another turn. So we can kill this guy in one right now. No point risking damage for nothing. And then kill him with this. Boom, bam. Burnout seems crazy strong. Oh, he is. Unfortunately, if the fight goes too long, he becomes useless. Like, that's the issue. Is he has no way to boost his damage. Once he's done too many, like, refreshes, he's useless. And you have to switch to a new character. Or hope the fight's over. See, he's down to doing five damage per hit. On his next one, he's only gonna do four. Or three, it's even lower. See, he's got diminishing damage as time goes on. He burns out. Get it? <laughs> oh, what the fuck is that? What is that? What is that? Vabula and Kakastel. I feel like I made a big mistake fighting these guys. He's actually, they're strangling, they're strangling burnout. Well, I feel like I have to kill them first. Which means we're in this until we get a double re, oh, maybe we refresh right now and we kill him in one. Well, we're actually gonna be on, mm, I'm not, wait, it says I'll still do eight. Nope, it lied. It's fine, we refreshed anyways, kill him. Simple as that. Easy. Damn, we're strong. Uh, that guy's gonna lick everyone. Uh, I'm gonna give him a slap. Boom. I'm on turn. It. Deals almost no damage to the opposing party members twice. Okay. Well, no X gonna move in and get a hit. I mean, we gotta kill this guy. It's gonna take a million years, but we kinda gotta kill him. I'm gonna move Burnout in. I'm gonna have him start doing his thing. Five damage. Refresh it. <laughs> Four damage. And then I'm gonna have uh, you move out of the way. Next turn, we pop off. Two whole damage! Okay, what the fuck? Spawns as many Kikos as possible at the cost of the enemy's health. Applies too frail to this enemy. Well, what if I don't want you to do that? What if I would do whatever it takes to stop that from happening? Oh, Hans. Okay, here's what we do. Burnout's already got barely any freaking function left, so what we do is we are going to use this to get rid of some overflow, refresh ourselves, and then beat the shit out of this guy at full damage and see how many how many hits we get in before he bails. One. Two. That's it. All right, he leaves. So he won't take any more damage. And that almost fully killed him. All right, that was about as good as it could have possibly gone. Nowak can kill him and then these two will be safe from any hits. Oh. Okay, I do need to burn. I gotta get rid of some overflow. But I'm worried about Hans. He's not gonna like what happens. Ow! 
Oh, that one had cleave. That's not ideal. Oh, guys, I really should have checked. Guys, it's bad! When, when they said they were gonna make the game harder, they meant it! I do six damage a hit. Oh, the overflow. Okay, I all I have to do is burn this to get rid of the overflow. Get focus on some one shotting after this. Move Hans here. We can't use a heal right now. But no one's gonna get hit now. And then I can have Noak start clearing. Oh, they bugged out. Wait, we won! Simple as that, baby. Woo! It's okay, guys. All I had to do was just not play. What the fuck is that guy? Let me rank up. Hang on. Let me rank up burnout. Hey. Oh, hello. Are you also a traveler? Yeah. I suppose I am. Oh, that is spectacular. Far too many souls are content to just be well dead. If I might ask, what is your destination? It was revenge of the petty variety, but now I'm not so sure. It sounds so much worse when you put it that way. Oh, yeah, well, hopefully the bastard has it coming. We may have more in common than I thought. Would you like to hear of my goal? Sure. Well, well, ever since I was a child, I have always wanted to become the... He suddenly falls silent. I'm sorry. I won't burden you with my childish ambitions. His voice betrays his embarrassment. I suspect our crossing is coming to a close. Before we depart, may I ask your name? Uh, Noak. Okay. You? Hiker? Well, Noak, I hope we cross paths again someday, and if you ever find a way to safely escape this desert, please let me know. Okay, bye, man. I'm gonna hang out with the guy who goes blah, 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 blah. Hello, baby, barius. Very door? What? Very, very vasim. Huh? Sokoko Majidara Abibargo. Zebi. Zebi. Wow. Okay, bye forever. Zebi. Just a bunch of worms fucking kill them. Do this one clean. Okay, burnout moves here, gets a punch in after nowhere could get to hit on this one. Cool. Burnout, kill that one. Bam. He refreshes, I'm gonna move Nowak here then. I'm gonna have Burnout kill again. Seven. He doesn't refresh again, that's fine. Get him out of here, get the, get Hans out of here. We've had a shortage of what I need for Hans to heal. Is, uh, been, has been the issue with them so far. Serious shortage. Okay, so we use, we move Noak in first. Tee up the hits. Now Hans gets a slap. Firm smack. And then burnout confirms his kill. That or I just... No, no, no. Mmm, I don't think it'll kill. Wait, I didn't refresh, so it's, uh, it should, it should, it should. It should, okay. We're good. We're good, everything's fine. Based Zebby takes. Guys, the Zebby guy is not based. I kind of want to start, if I start with blue pigment, then I have healing. I think I'm going to get that. Wait, 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 what's soggy bandages? Uh, increases party member's maximum health by 10. This party member now has leaky as a passive. Okay, we're going to take the pills. Uh, I'm not going to take, uh, leaky as a pa- I don't even know what that means. Uh, but we want blue. So that Hans can actually heal. Oh, it's the guy who, who likes Jesus. Wow. I really hope there's a god. Otherwise, this is all really a lot to take in. Oh, yeah, it's the anxiety guy. Who, oh, we haven't met this guy before. Ugly! 
Are you talking to me? The fact you assumed I was talking to you speaks volumes about your self-esteem. You gotta have confidence, man. But yeah, I was talking about you. Oh. Ugly, 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 ugly. Okay, bye. <laughs> He's got a point. We don't like him because he speaks the truth. Oh. That ringle might be the worst fucking thing I've seen today. That ringle might be the worst fucking thing I've seen all day. And I've seen some bullshit. I see another bad thing on the other side of the freaking battlefield. And that is the worst one. This guy is like a like a, a nice vacation from looking at this guy. <laughs> Just awful. Just terrible. I want them dead. I'll do whatever it takes to have them dead. Honestly. I kind of want to do a heal. I don't know. Wait, wait. Why don't I know what any of them are doing? Ringle must die. <laughs> we got to kill Ringle right now. Get him. Okay. Not ideal that this one was doing an attack, but there was no way for me to know. I'd like to do a heal. I don't want to move. I just want... I just want Hans to slowly feel better. You know what I mean? I just want Hans to feel better. Yeah, just keep on doing all your silly moves. It's not going to change how this all plays out, fools. Which one of these is the evil one that's attacking? This one. All right. No way I can kill him. We just need upgrades. We'll be okay once we have our upgrades. Refresher. Good. Now, Han, swap with them. Kill that guy. Good. Now, refresher gun. Okay, never mind. Heal. Heal those two. Very nice. Stop kissing me, you nasty worm. Stop it. Uh, it's worth doing this. Fight's almost over. I might get a kill if I do all these boosts. Boom, bam. Refresh, please. Nope, no refresh. Okay, no wick. Tragically can't get the kill, but they're gonna attack forward anyways, so we're just gonna move him out of the way Do another heal and finish this fight on the next round Yeah, I think they take fire damage at the end of their turn whoever ends their turn there. Yeah Okay, so they're dead just Gotta kill this guy which means all I need to do is have Hans move in and then perform Accidental malpractice. And then, have Nowak move in and fucking kill him. Simple as that. Guys, stop saying Zebby now. We don't know what that means. And I gotta rank up Nowak. We don't know what Zebby means. Ah, oh, fuck. We don't have any red. That's bad. Guys, that's really bad. That's like the worst thing that could have happened to us. Okay, they're doing a split here. Get him. Okay, I mean, I'd like this guy dead. Cool. No reds, huh? No reds anywhere. All right, Hans, can you do a heal? Cool. Zebby, parentheses respectfully. There we go. There, there it is. Now we just have to kill this ruminating Spoggle. OK. 
kill them. Finish this burnout. Finish this. End the fight. I was really hoping I would get like a fourth party member before going to the first boss, but I don't think it's gonna happen, guys. I'm a little worried. I guess I can kill more worms. At least get Hans leveled up to max. At least I'm one-shotting these guys now, so that's cool. Uh, you first, right here. Boom, kill that guy. Boom. Now, burn out. Kill that one. And refresh. Very good. Switch with Hans. Who will then do a heal. A silly little heal. Katie, I order you to give Frick back to the people! Don't worry, Chad, I got you. They were they were flipping me off. I command you to let them frick as they so please. Oh shit. Let them frick. Let them frick. Thank you. Thank you. Finally, an item. Oh, Wicker Child. Upon death, destroy this item and spawn two level one copies of this party member. Wait, what? This guy about <laughs> this guy about to pop off with clones. Okay, so when he dies now, which is going to be intentional, I'm gonna dupe two of them. And then have two burnouts on opener. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh, Spike Man! Hang on, 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 hang <sighs> on. What a mess. Don't even think about it. This is the last one. I'll stop collecting freaks after this. You're absolutely awful at lying. Let's go, there's lots of other freaks to meet. This one just isn't coming with us. We should get him on our side now. If we don't get him on our side, he might be a problem later. Why? Because if we don't get him get on his good side now, we might not have another chance. Hmm, do you really think he could be a danger later? Oh, absolutely. I think this might be our only chance to get on his good side. Don't want those spike powers used against us, right? Hmm, yeah, go talk to him. Hey! Oh, yeah? Do you want to join us? Like on an adventure or something? Kinda. Yeah, sure. Ask about the spike powers. Do you... Do you have cool spike powers? What? He looks over at the impaled corpses. Oh, you think I... Wow. No, I have a serious health condition. Oh! I have no idea what happened to these guys. It's kinda like the opposite of powers, to be honest. Although I will admit, it's a touch ignorant to assume just because I'm covered in spikes, I go around impaling folks. You still want to come with us? Oh, yeah. Yeah, lead the way. Fennec has become an ally. Welcome to the team, man. What's your moves? He's got slap. Apply six shield to this party member's current position. Increase this party member's bone spurs strength by one. And deal two direct damage to this party member. Heal this party member for one health. 20% chance to remove one of the opposing enemy's abilities and deal two indirect damage to the opposing enemy upon receiving direct damage. He's like a thorns enemy. Okay. Cool. You gotta start thinking like a Zebby, Tomato. Stop saying that. Hang on, I'd like to upgrade Hans. Who's this guy? Life was so beautiful. Who could have thought that death could be just as gorgeous? This is the life. <laughs> okay, weirdo. What's this place? Fools. Yo, they selling boil here for seven dollars. I don't have that kind of money. I'll see you later. Let's fight the frogs. Hey, I'll see you later, boil. All right. Uh, let's see here. 
This guy's gonna cry out and summon a Flarb. Problem is, I can't be in front of this Flarb or he's gonna be a bigger issue. But then again, two Flarbs would be even worse. So I think I have to kill this guy. Yeah, I gotta kill him. But you see, here's what we do. We drop, we swap with Fennec. And now Fennec is gonna make a bunch of shield. Which will protect them from the impending death attack. Yes. Now Burnout, I want you to kill this freak. Kill the baby. F this guy's gonna be fine, guys. Don't even worry about him. He's gonna be fine. Nothing bad's ever happened. And we're gonna heal too on top of it. He's gonna be fine. He's not gonna die. Zebby's only fans. D dude, you gotta have better things to do with your time than this. You just gotta. Oh shit, he moves! Oh fuck! Oh fuck, Hans! Oh, he lived. We're okay. That could have been a lot worse. Kill. Kill the group. Thank you. That was actually pretty okay. Alright, uh, Burnout's got this. Kill him. Put him down. Refresh. And kill him. Wait, go back after- Oh, fuck. I pressed a little too quick there, chat, and it cost me everything. It's fine. He kills himself off of this as soon as I move Hans out of the way. Uh, I'm gonna do this. Damage him a little. And when he attacks uh, Fennec next, he'll just kill himself. Cool. Could have been cleaner. But I mashed that button forgetting that he would slide a little. Chest. Deal five direct damage to the opposing enemy upon this party member moving themselves to another position. Oh. Who's this clown? Trigger fingers. He only has 50 health! Fucking kill him! Shell shock. Inflicts one constricted to the right and left opposing position. Deals almost no damage to the left and right party members. Moves trigger finger to the left or right. Oh, God. Deals an agonizing amount of damage to the opposing party member. 50% chance to move trigger finger left or right. Oh, this sucks. What is, this music's kind of silly, though. Look at this. Just fucking kill him. You know, that's... Wait, he lost a thing. Formless. I should check what this is. Reroll one of his abilities. Okay, so now he does constrict and almost no damage on both. Then I want to leave him like this. I want to move Hans here and I want to heal everyone. While he's doing very minimal damage to the group. And we'll just move this guy in so he does damage with the bone thing. Perfect. Yeah. Boost my damage even more. He's gonna move randomly, but maybe it'll be okay. We'll split up so it's not too crazy. Okay, perfect. He positioned himself in the wrong fucking spot. Headshot kills the opposing party member. Go ahead, kill him. You'll make two clones that I'll use later. <laughs> Go ahead, fucking put him down. Kill him! Kill him! Kill my boy! Put him in the ground! You're just gonna make him even stronger! Pull the trigger! <laughs> That's what I want you to do! Do I, though? Kinda, yes. Yeah, why don't I use this opportunity to, uh... Get myself focused. Will these guys be instantly put in my party, though? Spawn two level one copies of this. This could be an insane psychomaniac gamer move, guys. 
I think I'm gonna roll with it. Worst case, we have to reset. But it could be a god tier gamer move. I think I'm gonna go. I think I'm gonna do it. If I hit him, he resets his move and he might not do it. I'm gonna use no X focus thing and boost my focus now while he's sitting here safely. Oh, I took damage again somehow. I don't know how that happened. Weird. Okay, well. Make the clones! Oh! Your buddy died. What? Is there some sort of demon magic you can do to bring them back? Yeah. I'm not going to, though. Just stop getting people killed. Easy. Arise! Arise! Now you're fucked. Now you're fucking dead. Start the blasts. Boom, bam. Refresh. Go again. Boom, bam. Good. Refresh. Go again. Boom, bam. Refresh. Lame exit. Fill for it. Using blue. Oh, you can't. Oh, you can't. Okay, perfect. Fill for it. Refresh again. Boom, bam. Blast him. Okay. Burnout. Move to his spot, burnout. <laughs> Blast him. Boom, bam. Okay. No whack. Move into position. Blast him. Move Hans here. Get rid of some overflow. Next turn, he's dead. Enter. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, he fucking missed every shot, too. It's over. He just killed himself. All right, guys, good news. We won. And now we have two burnouts. That's crazy. Hopefully. <laughs> it's as simple as that, baby. It's as simple as that. Holy shit. And you know what that means. They're both now level two. <laughs> Is that like a... Is that like a, like, game ending kind of like god tier super move? I feel like I just immediately broke the game with two of him. Oh, this guy again. I'd rather have items. We have two burnouts with no items. <laughs> All right, gonna go ahead and toss that right on one of the burnouts. Now he's taking one to six less damage every turn. Go for another item. You ha increase his party member's health by seven on turn. Randomize his party member's health color. Okay. Put that on the other burnout. Go again. Pick up money. Eight coins. Leave again. Go talk to this dude now. Hire him to the team. Hey. Hey, uh... Why do you want me? What do you want again? Music man. He wants us to kill more music man. He really, really doesn't like music man. Okay. I'll see you later. I'm going to pick up another item. Adds original sin as an additional ability. A powerful but limited healing ability. Guys, wouldn't it be really cool if uh, Hans knew how to cast original sin? Wouldn't that be really epic if Hunt knew how to cast the original sin. See, the problem is we're a lot more prone to damage now because of all the uh, space on the board. So we gotta be a lot smarter now. Who's doing attacks that are forward? This corner's safe. That guy's doing a forward attack. Only the... Okay, so that side is gonna have issues because they're doing... Oh, everyone's doing a forward attack. Okay, perfect. Cool. 
That guy's safe no matter what, so we want to clear from here over. So I'm going to start with Noek hitting this guy. Burn out. Swap and punch. Did not refresh. That's fine. Move the next one in. Tragically did not refresh again. Heal this uh, party member to health. Refresh this party member's abilities. 25% chance to curse this party member. Deal two damage to this party member if cursed. Okay, this isn't even like a Hans thing. This is a we put this also on burnout thing. Or we put this on Nowak. Good to know for the future. Gonna go ahead and get an AoE heal on us. Huge. I don't really want him to produce a bunch of blue pigment on me, honestly. I'm not going to be able to kill any of these guys on this one. What I can do is move Fennec over here and get rid of... Oh, yeah, I forgot when he moves, he does five damage. Yeah, get rid of one of his abilities. Maybe it'll stop him from using his thing. Oh, okay. Five damage ain't bad. Crooked die! Hans, no! Stop hitting them! Holy shit, we're about to eat a lot of damage if we don't clear this board, chat. Do an AoE heal. Okay. You first. You need to start clearing. Refresh? Good. Attack again. Guys, we just have to refresh every attack. Guys, it's fine. We just have to burn every single one of our fucking moves right now. Punch again. Nice. 12% self damage. Hold! Hold! Hold, everything's fine, hold! We're gonna be okay! I just need everyone to relax. Ah, oh, fuck. That's actually not that much damage. I really thought that was gonna be a lot more. <laughs> Wait, guys, it's okay. It was just one. I healed that with one move from Han. We're gonna be okay. Hey, check this one out. Check this out, guys. Boom. Fixed it. Problem solved. Beat the crap out of these guys. Kill them. Seven damage. No refresh. Uh, if we move him here, that guy dies. Cool. That's huge. And now we beat the shit out of this guy with this one. I think he's gonna transform before I get the chance. Unless... I do this. Burn him. Yeah, I think he dies. I think he'll die. If I... Yeah, I think he's gonna die. Damn! What the fuck is that thing? That's a... Chor... Chordo phone. Yeah, that sucks. I do not like the Chordo phone, guys. Seven. Okay, let's see if I can maximize. Let's see if I can get a heal in on the gang that's here. Die. 
God, I really like the Ram item, dude. That's great. This guy's kind of useless, though. I don't really like Fennec as a character. Alright, boost to the next burnout, dude. Who's this? There's a vile slurping and choking noise from inside this mangled river of corpse. What is it? I think someone's in there. I don't think whatever is in there is a someone. Let me try something. You step closer to the corpse. You knock near a sphincter-like borehole in the corpse. Your plan is to knock like it's a door? Is it someone new? Does it bring promise of feast? Hello? It smells little of feast. When it smells of feast, it shall feast with the long liver. What? It will watch its allies die to smell a feast. It shall return. For better or for worse, I don't think that thing is coming out. Let's just go. This is getting too weird. Okay, bye. Bye bye. What the fuck is that? Oh, guys, guys, it's okay. It's just a singing stone. It's just a singing stone. Kill it. It's restricting my movement. Kill it. Swap positions, instantly destroy it with the ram. It's time. Kill this guy next. Yes, just in time for the next burnout to kick your ass. Yeah, 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 you know this one's upgraded, right? Where are you going? Where the hell are you going? Where are you going? Kill him. Yes. If I move this guy like this, does he do five damage again? No, it's only when I intentionally do it. Okay. Oh, I pressed the wrong one. Fuck, I wanted to do complex weave. Oh, well, he's gonna hit my thorns guy. That's fine. All right. Boom, bam. Uh, oh, this is actually free. Boom, bam. Yeah, my overflow is bad, guys. I need an item to mitigate my overflow. Or I really don't know how I'm gonna survive. Or I just keep pumping my damage. I don't even like this guy. Fennec's gonna be tossed in the garbage the second I have the chance to get rid of him. And keep saving up for the next tier of upgrades for everyone else. Who's this idiot? Wriggling sacrifice. And I don't like that. That's like a mini boss, guys. We're in trouble. Okay, uh, what's the fuck it deals agonizing amount of damage to the opposing party member. Okay, applies spotlight to this enemy inflicts one scar on this enemy. Fuck. That's not good. Okay, here's what we do. Here's how we do this. No whack hits this guy. Move this dude here for the free five damage. Move you in here, here next. Smack him once. Kill him. Get him off the board. Then, Hans heals. We don't know what this guy does. What I'm gonna do now is have Burnout bail out. Have this Burnout fuck off. But after he does a certain amount of attacks here. I want him off the board because there's not enough space for someone to not get hit on this attack. I'd rather just not have him here. Since he's the lower level one. Jesus! I have good news and bad news. That enemy has the spotlight. Until they are killed, they are going to be dealing double damage. But they will also be receiving double damage. If you kill them, you can steal the spotlight from them. Only one thing can be in the spotlight at a time. They're also wounded. Giving enemy scars causes them to take an extra point of damage per scar every time they receive damage. This is gonna be fun. But make sure you guys don't get too many scars. They aren't lost until the end of combat. You're gonna fucking die.
they're crying now. God, they get two moves a turn, huh? It's already pretty bad, guys. They're gonna transform? They need to die. <laughs> we have to kill this freak right now, stat! First of all, Fennec, move in. 12 damage a hit. AoE heal. Get rid of some of our freaking points. All right. Then, Noak, move in. Beat the shit out of him. Ten damage, fifty percent chance to refresh. We do this first. Come on, refresh him. Yes. Now you're fucked. The fuck out of here. He's got the spotlight now, guys. Piece of cake. Take a little bit of damage, but that's nothing Hans can't heal. What happened? What happened? Ungod? Guys, God's here. <laughs> That's not supposed to happen. It's fine. Burnout's got double damage. Guys. Besides, he's just gonna curse us all this turn. 18 damage. He refreshed. All right, here's what we do, guys. Boom, bam. Watch this. He's back. Explosive exit him. We're gonna go for maximum damage. 20 more damage. Refresh. No whack. Swap with him. Hit him again. 18 damage. No more refresh. Move him in here. Five more damage on that. Frailty. We're still going to be taking a boatload of damage off of this. It's okay, guys. We're just cursed. We just have to do 28 damage. It's fine. Because we're going to frailty him again. Then Noak's going to move into that spot. And he's going to fucking finish this. Check this one out. I'm about to pop off. What's his move here he's going to do now? Set all party members' health equal to the health of the party member with the lowest health. As all things should be. I don't fucking like that. Get ready to die. 16. All we gotta do... Is have Fennec... Come on, dude, he ran! Pussy! Okay, worst thing that's gonna happen is we're gonna lower all of our health, but we're gonna- we're gonna be okay. Everyone's gonna go to five, but we'll win. Scary, but we got him. Could have been worse. Freak! Get the hell out of here! We got two- items out of that. That was like a straight up mini boss. Okay. Um, what is this? A blackened toad. Remove all purple pigment from the pigment bar at the end of each turn and deal two indirect damage to a random enemy for each pigment removed. That's, uh, really good. This party member now has skittish as a passive. Heal this party member for zero to three health upon moving. Dice is cool. Um, Black and Toad is better. And, uh... I think I'm gonna move Rib of Eve to them. Put the skateboard on... Or the frickin' uh, ice skates on, uh, hands. Now, I'd like to upgrade Noak to also have uh, higher tier stuff. 
I don't know why I took on this fight, because I don't think I'm going to be able to get another couple levels or even a level before I have to fight the boss, but you know what? It's fine. It's fine. Who's attacking first? The f guy on the far side. Okay. No Lark going after them then. 10 damage. Burn out. 10 damage. Okay. Who's attacking next? That guy? Nine damage. Refresh again. Fuck. God damn it. Damn. Kill him. Bada bing. All right. Who's that freak? Okay, well. Still get a little bit of healing it. Tomato is burnout maxing. I sure am. Oh, I get it now. The singing stone is what's on their head and it fell off of their head when we killed them. I, I see, I see. It's disgusting and horrible. That's just awful. Kill him. Get rid of him. He will heal. Oh my God. The fucking self damage we are sustaining from overflow is bad guys. It's really bad, guys! And damage. We have no way to kill these things. Who would I want to take this hit? Probably Burnout. Oh! We're fine. They're gonna spawn with barely- they spawned with full health. We're fucking dead. We're dead, it's over. Hit this guy, kill him. My overflow is bad! Get rid of them next. Kill him. Nine. Oh, God damn it. I have a guaranteed kill if I move over and just kill him. Or we'll just get rid of this guy. Okay. It's just us in this saltery. Just trying to burn fucking points. I need to move on close enough to heal them. This is bad. Fennec is gonna die, and that's a damn shame, even though honestly I could live with that. They're kind of not very good. They're kind of the bad teammate. I prefer having another burnout. Minor key. Okay, my max health is down, but I can live with that. They're just debuffing me forever. It's fine. What we're gonna do is we're gonna just beat the shit out of this guy until he's dead this turn. We should be able to get it. The math adds up, it's over for him. Especially, God, if we refresh 15 times, then we definitely got him. We refreshed every time. Jesus. Fennec is good, I swear. I don't fucking believe you. Dried paint. Oh, thank God. Buy it. Someone's getting that instead of what they have. Uh... You. Uh, we don't need the extra health as much as we just need. We're taking all that damage anyways. Uh, I guess let's do the fight. It's this dude again. Smooth skin again. I think Fennec sucks. Frick. Yeah, he's not great. Ooh, every time we hit this guy, we'll be able to do an A, like a huge amount of damage on him with my, uh, frog. Okay. There we go. 
build some red. We're gonna kill this dude the rest of the way with uh, Burnout's first attack here. He refreshes. Gonna swap him to be in front now. Keep hitting him. Good. He refreshed again. Hit him again then. Okay, so he's gonna do one agonizing attack in front. But here's my plan. This is another fight where it's best not to have two burnouts. So I'm almost tempted just to have this burnout bail out after the first round. Just because there's not enough board. You know? Yeah, I think I want to do the AoE burn on this guy since he's not going to move just yet. And then try to just fish for refreshes. Okay, he's going to leave. This guy's at 50%. Which means we won't get hit. Okay. Cool. Let's go. Because no one gets hit by that attack. These guys should have it. <laughs> Unless this... That guy's got a gun! It's fine. It's all gonna be fine. Both those guys are trying to kill, uh... Kill our boy, Hans. I'm gonna move Burnout in. You guys wanna see me pop the fuck off? You guys wanna see me pop the fuck off? You guys wanna see me pop the fuck off? Y'all want to see me pop the fuck off? You guys want to see Burnout break the game? Hans! I need you to finish this! The worst thing that could have happened was them automatically skittishing where Fennec was because Fennec needed to move onto him to do the last five damage. But good news is Nowak still has movement, so I can do this. See ya, doofus! See ya, doofus! Loser! Guys. I'm pretty good at this game. <laughs> I'm definitely not cheesing a mechanic at all, guys. This is all intent. Guys, I'm totally. Wait, what is this place? You unlock the bloating coffers. Where the hell am I? Is that an ear with a knife? I want that person. They got a sword. Hey, join my team. Take one step closer, and I will fucking cut your head off. <laughs> okay, chill. Oh, maybe we should just leave. I I'm sorry, we were just looking for allies. This strange place is extremely dangerous. Have you been out here all alone? She subtly looks you up and down. Are you real? Are you another one of those things? Her grip tightens as she speaks. You can hear her teeth clench behind her mask. I'm human, just like you. How do I know you won't rupture into Rodifers the second I look away? Or that you aren't another bloated spider wearing a corpse? I'll find a way out of these caves. I don't need you. What? Caves? Bloated spiders? Noak, I don't think she's in the same place as us. Well, she's physically, but spiritually, I don't think so. Her inner world doesn't seem to match with our own. What would you need in order to trust us? She lowers her defenses for an almost imperceptible degree. I have debts, material and otherwise. 50 coins here and now. With that kind of money, you may be worth the trouble. Oh, fuck off. But be warned, the curse that afflicts me is a starving thing, and I don't control when it feasts. What the hell does that mean? Listen, I'm not sure we need the help of every dangerous weirdo we meet. Agreed. Yeah, I'm not paying that shit. Bye. Goodbye. I'm out. Wasted my fucking time. You have obtained little aura. 
This party member now deals 15% more damage to enemies. This party member now deals 100% more enemies if the attacked enemy is a fish. What the fuck is that guy sloth squatting? I didn't sign up for you two. Giggling Minister, Skinning Homunculus, and Choir Boy. Uh, okay, um... These guys have a lot of moves, chat. This is, um... This place is, um... Any of you fish? Welcome to the fuck zone. Chat, am I in trouble? Is this gonna be like a bad zone? Am I, am I, am I in big trouble? Wretched thief, enemy will move to the left or right or stay in this position, dealing an agonizing amount of damage to the opposing party member and destroys that party member's held item? Fuck off. We gotta kill this guy. Nothing else matters. I'm ignoring all other mechanics. He has to die immediately. He's gonna keep on being slippery, isn't he? Fuck. Stop dodging me! Want it to be Hans who gets killed. Their item is trash. <sighs> no! Hans, why? Get back in the fight, pussy! <sighs> You're right where you belong, boy. Oh fuck! Oh, thank God. It was Hans that got hit. We're okay, guys. We might just make it out of this alive. What is this? What kind of magic nonsense? I think this is this divine protection will prevent you from taking damage, but that sounds too good to be true. What the fuck does that mean? Oh, damage received will be redirected to allies without divine protection. CAN I HAVE A TURN TODAY?! CAN I HAVE A TURN TODAY?! WHAT IS THIS?! CAN I GET A TURN?! Welcome to the fuck zone. Dude, my build was perfect! Everything was going according to plan! Kill him! Kill that freak! Oh, he... Nope, he kept it. I thought he maybe he dropped the item again. Nope. Apparently, this guy is going to... And I quote... Obliterate... Hans. <laughs> Guys. Guys, it's bad. Hans is about to be obliterated. <laughs> Maybe if I hit him, they'll stop. That's all I can think. Nope, they're still planning on it. Hans. Hans, it's bad. Get him out of there. Guys. It's gotta be Fennec, right? Fennec's gotta die. No! No! It has to be Hans! It can't be Burnout too. I'm sorry, Hans. Burnout 2 tragically had one more move and I didn't notice he refreshed. That is, uh... 
a mighty shame. Oh, it's the last thing you'll do before you die is heal the party. Go on. No! Wait, that's okay. No! No! Oh, shit! He got- he hit the device- it's okay guys, Hans was meant to die! <laughs> guys, what's going on, man? Dude, fuck off! It's not over till burnout says it's over, brother. It ain't over till burnout says so, brother. Bring yourself to me. Die, you fucking piece of shit. All right, you can go home now, God. And go home. Oh, well, it was destined eventually. Not him! Oh. Oh, fuck. The shield. We're still in the fight, baby. We're still in the fight. I didn't hear no bell. I didn't hear no bell. I didn't hear no bell, guys. I'm bringing it down. I'm bringing it down to the freaking refreshes, motherfucker. Refresh. Kill him now before it's too late. Sometimes a man's got to believe in something. Shield. <laughs> Shield up! What's that, a suck? Deals a mortal amount of damage to the opposing party member and lethal amount of damage to this enemy. All I had to do was not tell him to leave. I live, bitch. Get up. No, 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 no! No, 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 no! No! Oh, what? You died? Sorry, I wasn't watching. Let's try this again. Meh. Meh. I gotta pee, man. I'll be right back. We ride again. We ride again. I don't get broken that easy. Maybe the problem is burnout isn't someone we should rely- I'm taking burnout again. Wait. You tell me I could just get rid of his departure move and make him do even more damage? Up front? You telling me he's got two moves that do that? Hang on. Hang on, we're taking we're taking burnout again. Oh, why'd I have to bring the loser?
Ah, oh, fuck off! Whatever, you know, who cares? Very good start. Wait, what's this? Do I have a new item? What's that skull? Oh, I guess it's just signifying that's no way. Okay. Ten bucks. Instant level up for burn. <laughs> for burnout. It's as simple as that. Let's roll. Seven more dollars. We go again. Who's this guy? What are you gonna do? Stab me? God, even my last words were rubbish. What a waste I turned out to be. <laughs> go away. I'm not in the mood. Okay, bye, man. You have a good time. Do whatever it is you do. Mungling Mudlung. Okay, that one sucks. We're gonna kill that one, I think. But I'm gonna start with this. I'm gonna start with killing the little one. As is tradition. Yep. Die. So let's see, Bone Buster, it does nine damage. This does 13 and decreases the damage of it forever. 6% chance to refresh his party member per surviving enemy. That's... Fucking hell, give it up! Give it up, freak! Apply three shield to the left and right members uh, of this party. Increase his party member's bone spur strength by one. Yeah. Start putting shields down. Broke him like an egg, man. It's the it's the fucking fish item, dude. If as long as it's fish, like it's over, dude. There's not there's nothing these guys can do. As long as the enemies remain fish. I just keep spamming this. Yeah. Cool. Alright, well. Fucking kill him, Burnout. You're the main character. Jesus. No whack neck. Oh, this guy's back. Found it safe way out of the desert yet? Every attempt at leaving this desert has resulted in casualties, unfortunately. Ah, well, if you ever safely escape, please let me know. I fear the cost of forging my own path. Okay. Heh. <laughs> I guess I did want to live after all. That guy's useless to me. He's nothing. We fight the worms. Damn, dude. He's trash. He's no one to me. He doesn't matter. Break this guy in half. Uh. Move out of the way. Move out of the way. Enter. Very good. Boom. And bam. Piece of cake. Easiest kill of my life. These guys were nothing. We're lucky we'll have enough money now to upgrade Fennec and then maybe he won't be the trashiest character ever, but surely that won't end up being the case. Let's be real. This party member deals 25% more direct damage to enemies with lower health than this party member. That's really fucking good as well. That's really fucking good as well. We are getting some crazy items, guys. I gotta get rid of Ringle. Or we're never gonna know what's going on. Yeah. Okay. Burn out. Beat the crap out of him, kill him. 
I see what's going on now. Oh shit. Uh, do this anyway. Shield yourself up. We should be okay. Yes. Very good. Yes. Yes. Now kill that other fish too. Oh, whoops. Ah, well. Fill and kill him. It's fine. I didn't realize they didn't have red on me. Ten damage. Very good. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like Nowak needs a different move. I never use the parry. Maybe I should. The fact that it's not a guaranteed direction and it's random whether or not they go left or right kind of makes me not want to use it. Uh-uh, I don't fuck with that. Uh, prevent party member from being inflicted with frail. Heal this party member one health if they do not perform any ability this turn. Buy it. Unfortunately, that's the best item we could possibly give Fennec, the worst character in the game. You guys think there's going to be anyone here that's going to be worth zero dollars like they want to just get rid of them? No. Damn. Alright, bye guys. Bye guys. We're going to have Burnout get rid of this fish in a second. Good. All right, it's just two guys attacking forward, so we're just gonna get the fuck out of the way. These mongols don't stand a chance. Wait, what's happening with this? Oh, it's a mongi. I'm gonna fucking kill it. Welcome to welcome to life, creature. Remove that thing from its freaking cage. That one's gonna attack twice forward. It's gonna make a shield. Those four seconds, yeah, those four seconds of life for them must have been fucking rad. Like, absolutely crazy. Just wild. Piece of cake. I don't make uh, enough money off of these trash kills. Oh, this guy looks like a healer. Hello. We are look. You're fortunate to have caught me like this. Visible. What do you mean? Upon death, I was blessed by a holy flame. A gift from God himself. And now, under these bandages, I am rendered invisible. Indeed. Bosch lets out an audible groan. After my blessing, the doctors carried me to their tent to try to understand the miracle they had witnessed. After stripping me of my melted garment, they declared, He is gone, as my physical body had become invisible. They wrapped me in these bandages as a last-ditch attempt to track my presence. Even these highly trained professionals were baffled by my newfound gift. As they worked on others in that tent, it was clear that I'd become invisible to all unworthy. Do you want- I will not cooperate with you unless you have proven yourself worthy by surviving three combat encounters totally and absolutely unscathed. If he cuts us off one more time, I'm going to kill both of you and then myself. Okay, bye. I want this clown. Hey. My name's Admo. Admo. Oh, okay. Well, see ya, Admo. Admo. Once I... I once had kidney stones so big you could play marbles with them. Pretty cool, huh? Admo. Bye, Admo. Okay, see you later, Admo. Hey, 
if that guy summoned a flower, but there wouldn't be any way to... There wouldn't be any space for one. I think I just... I think I just go all in on killing this guy. Break him in half. Which one of these guys attack? That one? Okay. Surely this won't make a flarb. There's no space to make a flarb. So there's no space for a flarb. No flarb, see? No flarb. See, now we kill all of the children. Now we kill all of the children. Move him over. Move you here. And then you also kill. Yes. Now he'll throw his little tantrum, but he won't hit anyone. No way he hits anyone. It's gonna be fine. He's not gonna jump over and hit nowhere. He won't. He's not gonna hit him. Aw, oh, fuck. Ow. No way he- ah. Now you're gonna fucking die. Now you're gonna fucking die for that. You're done. Die. Flarb. Another easy win. If only we had a healer. If only Fennec wasn't totally trash. I mean, I guess I should go to the boss. I think it's over. This guy again? We're fucked. I beat this guy with cheesing last time. We're fucking done. Guys, it's over. It's the psycho. Okay, well... Here's what we do. We just give him the full business. Then we move this guy into the middle. And we add shields to all of us. And we hope that's enough to keep us alive. Well, that does work. Alright. I mean, we might be okay. He's actually fleeing the premises and I can't chase him because I'm restrained. So I'm just gonna put another shield down and pretend none of this is happening, I guess. Yep. Yeah, we'll just hang out. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I think we just got him. That wasn't that bad. Uh, you first. Because he's going to move back into one of these two spots, I think, after this. Yeah, I think we just won. I mean, we just won if I hit a double, triple refresh. I did not. I think my guy is dead. No! No! Stream's over. All right, guys, it's been four hours. You know what that means? It's time to move on with our lives. But this game was really cool. But Burnout's dead, so I have no reason to keep playing. I would have I would have given up anyways. So at least now we don't have to live in a world where Burnout wasn't in our team. It's fine. Cool game, though. Definitely worth checking out. I really liked it. Thanks for coming on by. I may be streaming tomorrow, so keep your eyes peeled at the usual time. Okay? But if I'm not, then you'll see me on Thursday. All right? It's been a pleasure. See you all next time. Goodbye.